<laughs> Penny always talks until Wario shows up. Yeah, he's the one exception. Um, hey, so uh, last time we left off, we had just unlocked a planet. I think we unlocked like a distribution facility. Yeah, oh, exactly. Oh my God. <laughs> that was memory only, baby. Uh, yeah, we unlocked this distribution oh, yeah. facility. This is happening. Maple cheese donated ten dollars. <laughs> All right, hope you have a good stream. I'm going to go heat up my soup. Enjoy the soup. Um. Uh, uh we unlocked this distribution facility. Uh, because they're like, they're about to send out these these. So they're the proto pets, the little fuzzy guys are like off the rails and they're like just gonna, they're gonna, they're just gonna fuck everything up. That's really just the easiest way to say it. They're gonna really fuck everything up and now they're like about to be sold as toys. Um, so uh, we are going to uh, go work towards stopping that by blowing up the distribution facility. I don't know if that's actually what we're doing, but given <laughs> the ways of Ratchet and Clank, I assume it's not gonna be too far off. Um, so I wanted to, so we, obviously we're still working towards upgrading a lot of these weapons. I still really want to upgrade the bouncer. Um, sheepinator, I would love to upgrade it, but I don't use it a lot. I would, you know what? You know what, as great as the sheepinator is, I'm moving it off for the quick select because I don't, the only reason I have been considering using the sheepinator and like trying to use it every so often and keeping it on the quick select is because of like the completionist desire to want to upgrade it, right? And like get that done. But like the stream is not a completion run. We're like nearing the end of the game. Um, and hopefully, you know, we're gonna get there tonight. And like, I just, I just, I'm not gonna use it once it's upgraded. If I force myself to use it until it's upgraded, I'm not, I, that's when I'll stop, you know? Like I, I will essentially be wasting all that time when I could be upgrading something else. So um, it's not that I don't like it. I just don't, I don't use it. I don't ever use the Sheepinator. It, the Sheepinator is like one of, <laughs> it's like one of the earliest instances of like, oh, this is like a, this is a joke weapon. Like, the, this weapon is more of a joke than it is, like, a useful thing. To me. To me, at least. I consider it like a, oh, a sheep in here. That's a goofy Ratchet and Clank thing. Tur turn enemies into sheep? Right? Like, you know. Don't forget the hyphen between spider um, and Um, so man. I'm gonna replace it with... Good challenger donated $5. You know what? Fuck you on Ratchet's your Clank. <laughs> Jokes aside, thanks for streaming tonight. Long day at work. And I can finally chill with tomorrow off. Hell yeah. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, oh, but I wanna, you know, I'll just replace it with the mini nuke. Spider and man. Ranger underscore Alistair donated $10. Oh. Well, here's my first tip to my knowledge. Here you go. Thank you, Ranger. Wait, what was the tip? What do you need to tell me? What's your advice? Haha, <laughs> get it? Because it's like a, like a, do you get it? Maple cheese donated twenty five dollars. Oh my god! I maple. took out a personal loan at the bank. Good thing you don't have to pay those back, right? Anyway, hope this prank of giving you fifty dollars didn't take too much away from your stream. It'll sit and watch quietly now. Thank you. I I appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay. Uh, <laughs> I was I was I was worried. I was like, did that actually happen? You should be fucking saving your money. Um, it's hard to tell. Uh, but thank you. Yeah, that's very generous. Um, okay. Uh, was of uh, oh yeah, distribution facility. So we are we're currently at Thug HQ. Um, I've done like a lot of the stuff. I I off off stream between last stream and this one, um, I went and I did the uh like all of the races, like the hover hover bike races that I hadn't done yet. So those are done. So I I've just been working through it. Yeah. Um. Snail vape so donated the five dollars. Therese, this TikTok that gives me PTSD, where a guy just straight up drops a bag of marbles on a public restroom floor stall, and every time you use the bouncer, I get more flashbacks. Uh, does it make like a like a similar sound? That's that sounds like it sucks. Um, 
Oh, really quickly, by the way, holy shit! Oh my god, yo! <laughs> Zero January O donated $50. This isn't a prank, I just really enjoy your stream smile. Thank you! <laughs> that means a lot. Y'all y'all are great, thank you. Um, I wanted to, I wanted to mention, uh, so yeah, so I just I just mentioned I went and did those like the, those races and stuff. Um, and on, I, I, I accidentally triggered a cutscene that 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 y'all that y'all missed because I wasn't streaming when I when I went and did it. Um, it was it was it wasn't like a plot important cutscene. I don't think it was essentially just another like quark update cutscene. Um, it was like they it was like Ratchet and Clank were in the ship, and I I don't remember all the details, but essentially it just kind of ended on the note of them being like, "What's going on with Quark?" <laughs> like it was very like, "Yeah, we haven't seen him in a while." Um, if I remember correctly, that's, that's, a, that was essentially the point of it is they were like, they were like, I, it's glad, I'm glad we haven't run into him in a while. Um, you could probably see it in options. Oh, let me, let me look, let me look. Options. No. Special? Movies. <laughs> Damn. Why this image is is funny to me? Oh yeah, yeah. It was an it was one of the behind the hero ones. Oh, this is really useful actually. Meow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Here it was. Here it was. And now, behind the hero brings you the conclusion of our series on Captain Quark. Oh, the conclusion. As of this airing, the fugitive superhero has been missing for almost six weeks. Did he die heroically? Was he the victim of an overzealous fan? Or is he still out there somewhere? The galaxy may never know, but stay tuned for more baseless speculation and crackpot theories on Behind the Hero. Damn. I wonder, I, I really wonder, someone said there's also another one I haven't seen. Excitement. Oh yeah, what is this? We at Megacorp would like to congratulate you on your choice of the Commando-matic <laughs> body armor and helmet combo. Now that you've had a chance to use it, we'd like to demonstrate some of its most important functions. Okay. The Commando-matic helmet provides several helpful reasons. Oh, is this, <laughs> this it's like a tutorial? Your current and maximum nanotech units. Nanotech is your health, so make sure yeah, you don't Yeah, good. <laughs> this is one nanotech unit. That's fun. I'm not gonna watch it because it's a tutorial and we're on part five. But that's it's a fun little thing. Why did they put that in the what? Why did they just like stuff that in the cinematics menu? <laughs> that's funny. Um, oh, you can actually see the skill points. I be hey, look at how look how awesome I am. I beat two twenty seven in the hover bike race. Found all the crystals. Saved all the Taurus? I did. I thought I killed multiple of them in, in in cold blood. I'm not complaining. Oh no, there's so many. Oh, three out of thirty. That was all of them. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I want I wonder if we are going to see Quark. Or, or like, was he not like? Cause I, I get the, I get the sense that, that, like, he was really popular, and then, in this game, they just kind of talk about him, and if he's not in this game, it was probably a situation where they were like, what the fuck, bring him back, and then, who's to say? Um, do we want to get a new weapon while we're here? Donated five dollars. You save the tourists from the burden of life. That's true. That's how. That's how. We'll, that's how. That's how. That's how we'll look at it. Uh, what's the <sighs> mini rocket tube? Is only fifty thousand. We'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get it. What is this? What does this do? It's a, it's a, a tube of mini rockets. That seems very useful. Wait. <laughs> okay. Goodbye, mini nuke. Hello, mini rocket. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I. I will. In the meantime, though. In the meantime of what? I don't know what I'm saying. Bouncer time. We're upgrading the bouncer still. We need we need we need that in tip top shape. 
Um, boop, boop. So, our three. Ah, oh, it's a pretty small map. Nice, nice, very agreeable. Let's blow up the fucking distribution facility. Oh, God. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Can I? Shit. <laughs> Goodbye, James Arnold Taylor. Why is this on? No, I... I... <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, swing shot. There we go. There we go. There we go. <laughs> I never fall in pits. This is not a pit, this is clouds. Don't you understand? This is, this is not good for these guys. What am I doing? Oh my god, the frame rate. It said hello? Hi, is this running on the PS3? <gasps> That's what it said. <laughs> Verbatim. What? <laughs> is this some wily coyote ass humor? It's a me. My, my distinction between pits and clouds, or just the... <laughs> or or I, I guess me frantically switching midair may have been what you were talking about. I don't even know. Alright. Activate elevator. Y'all ever, ever consider... That you activate an elevator to me? I've always been... I've always... It's always been riding an elevator for me. I'm never like... I guess you do kind of activate the elevator though, because you like push the buttons and it goes, you know? So like, it's not even something I would like... This is, an, this is another like cooking versus baking, like a bullshit actually truly means nothing. I'm just trying to fill space. Debate? Not even debate, it's just like I, I'm just shitting. <laughs> I'm just doing the verbal equivalent of shitting. <laughs> That's, yeah. <laughs> it's, n it's not constructive, but it, you know, it fills time. <laughs> I'm still doing it. I'm not, this is not. This doesn't mean anything. That's what I get for streaming an hour later. The difference between 7 and 8 p.m. for me might as well be the difference between fucking June and December. Okay. Why didn't I use the bouncer? It was such an opportunity. Oh my god, the, 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 I hate killing enemies with a weapon, looking at the quick select and seeing that the experience bar hasn't visibly moved at all. I'm just like, oh, we're in for a ride, aren't we? I was like, can y'all hear the game well? Mini rocket would have been really useful in Snivelac. Well, you live and you learn. You give and you forget. No, I just I just want to refill the rocket. Thank you. Not the rocket, the jetpack. Okay. Uh, bouncer time? Huh. Oh my god, I was trying- I was trying to shoot it with the trigger. I was like, what the hell? Why is it not working? Oh, they- oh, they- oh, oh, wait, it's- oh, it's these guys! More nanotech, thank you very much. And they have- they have armor now, that's fucked up. Uh, yeah, oh my god, this is a- this is a spacious level. Why- why didn't I- Uh... I didn't activate that. Is this like a bonus? I just completely missed the actual like critical path. Who's to say? What the? Where the fuck am I going? Hello? Oh god. I I, I assume it's this, but that it looks too. 
Okay, I'm just getting it real high up. Yeah, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. That was that was scary for a moment. I was like, is anything coming down to, to save us? I, no, I'm just wasting bouncer ammo before I like before a point where I could actually use it. Oh, I could just sit here and farm these guys. Never mind. <laughs> I can't. I can't. The guy. The thing is gone. I. I mean, I wouldn't have anyway. That's that's stream poison. But like, I could have, if only my weapons weren't so explodey. I guess that's what that's what you sign up for. I know how to launch the levitator. Okay. Okay, yeah, but where the fuck am I going? This way? Ah, oh, this, this map is confusing. Not in a, not in a, huh, 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 Okay. All right. Okay, that's fine. That's pretty fine. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, not, not today, death. What the hell? Oh, that, that's like a, that's a tight fit. That's a tight fit in terms of, uh, levitation length. <laughs> what the, what the frick? What the frick? Ratchet with a jet pack? Okay. He do be levitating, though. These guys can piss off. Haha. <laughs> Damn. It's only 25 shots. That's not... That's not Pog. It's not Pog or Champ. Penny, please, what is that dog with headphones bit from? I will show you. Top five bruh moments. Part two, yes. All right. Hey, yeah, this is, this is, this is the bit. Top five bruh moments, part two. Yo, what the frick? Hedgehog on the phone? Okay, <laughs> but he do be needing an upgrade, though. What the frick? Truck drinking water? Okay, but he do be hydrating. A goat in high vis. Okay. He do be looking kind of safe, though. Hold up, dog with headphones. <laughs> what is he listening to? I don't know. He kind of just vibing, though. Hold up, dog with headphones. What the frick? A cat with pants on? Okay. He do be looking kind of... Fresh, though. Fresh, though. <laughs> she, says it so, she says it so timidly. Oh, oh, best part, best part. But the biggest bro moment... Is if you don't leave a like. <laughs> That's fucking so true. That's so true. You know, you know it's true. <laughs> biggest bra moment. But the biggest bra moment, if if you don't leave a like. <laughs> I don't. I I couldn't leave a like. I don't have TikTok. I don't, I don't, I don't oh, like yeah. videos on YouTube this unless they're from Dom Ferris <laughs> or Joel Aver. Thank you so much, Miss Parker. Thank you. <laughs> of course, you're very welcome. Always happy to. <laughs> Jim, Jim just launching into into a uh, cacophony of bras. <laughs> I don't have TikTok. What the fuck do you want from me? I'm not, I'm not gonna leave a like on somebody's repost of her video. 
I, I, I consider that a bigger bro moment. How, wait, how the hell do I, wait, what, what is this place? I think I passed there. Is there like a, is there a grapple point? It doesn't seem like, hey, jump. <laughs> Make one, I'm not, I'm not making a TikTok. I'm not making a TikTok just to never use it. <coughs> what the... What the hell? I'm majorly missing something here. No, you know, this makes perfect... This was also... I guess the problem I was having with... Uh, the beginning of the level. Because it was like... I couldn't see another path. It was it was also behind like some of these boxes. Um it's like a hmm. Oh, oh, there's a fucking there's a pad right there. Got it. I see I was I was too busy annihilating the, the noobs them being the, the funny crab creatures. I guess there also is one at the beginning of the level. Interesting. I'd like to go back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I dropped too early. Fuck. No, this is a real bro moment. No, yeah, so that, so that, so I, I referenced that and my friends referenced that a ton. Um, ever since discovering that it, that, ever since discovering it, um, Specifically, the one that really resonates with the crew is the, uh, Hold up, dog with headphones! I just, I, it resonates with me, I can speak personally. I think about that shit a lot, just because, like, it's, like, the video, like, her delivery of the lines in the video is generally pretty much the same. Um, until that part. Where it, she just she just rocks your world with just like a completely different line delivery, like something has changed in the narrative. Like hold up, dog with headphones. Like like she's like it's like a very it's like a real like hold up now. Like like, like shut the fuck up, shut the fuck up. Hold on, there's a dog wearing headphones. Yeah, like like a genuine surprise. Whereas the rest of it is like yo, what the frick? Go ahead. I doing me a favor. Love this guy already. Oh, sorry. It's just I thought you were one of them. Oh, dear, dear. What I give for even an ounce of their feral ignorance. A burden often accompanies self-awareness, sir. Living with the abject savagery of one's <laughs> own kith and kin. It's like when Patrick more than one can bear got his head hands. replaced with brain no, coral. The torment of it all. I remember that shit. That episode was like I hauntingly sad. Series designed to destroy. In that case, I have something that may interest you. But may I first humbly request a meager few bones for food? Dude, yeah, sure. We got plenty. Telescreen transmission. Lovely long time since I've eaten. This is Darla Gratch reporting live from All Gone City. Where Proto all gone? Is <laughs> Looks like that city is all gone. <laughs> Is Megacorp's wildly popular bioengineered pet. Adorable, non-allergenic, and housebroken. Fans of the creature have done Looks like all those houses are broken. <laughs> proto pet's surprisingly low price tag and its lightning fast breeding cycle, there may soon be more than enough proto pets for everyone. Darla Gratch, Channel 64 News. So they are twonkies. <laughs> The entire population of that planet. You tell it was a Nickelodeon kid. <laughs> this is fucking time. two Nickelodeon references in a row. I <laughs> <laughs> got him. <laughs> People are dying. Yeah. Yahoo! What of it? Snail vape donated five dollars. 
I woke up from a dead sleep at 4 a.m. once and my brain just played the audio to me at whole UHP dog with headphones. Oh, that dog with headphones. And I was trying so hard to remember where I heard it for like a week now. That's why I went feral when you said it again. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad I could help. Okay, so I guess... I don't know if that's the plot important. Oh, God. Oh, shit. I don't know if that's the plot important info bot, but we're going to this extra path anyway, because it's like, it's easy. It's not hard. It's a small level. We can do it. It won't hurt us too bad. Haha, <laughs> I get fucked. ba 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 Please, please, don't. <laughs> I hate when, like, I'm aiming, like, clearly aiming in a direction, and it goes, like, the diagonal of that direction just because it feels like it. I'm like, what are you, what are you playing at? Hello, goodbye. Bye. No, thanks. Jack two and three in a nutshell. Is that is that is that a notorious Jack thing that happens? Oh my God! Oh, the camera. What are you doing? So, <laughs> I'm not designed to fight in enclosed spaces. All of my weapons are ranged, and then I also have one that becomes a spider. Meteor gun is close range. The meteor gun is shit ranged. Bad gun. Bad top ten bad gun moments. I'm I'm forever mourning the loss of the lava gun, and I wasn't even sure I liked it until last stream. When I was like, oh, this is how you use it. <laughs> the mo the moment I learned how to use it properly. It was taken from me. I, oh my god, okay, the noise of the bouncer, though. Okay, it, it's, it's a little, it's a little bit, it's a little bit 2016, if you, you know, if you catch my drift. Um, oh god. Haha, <laughs> you, you mad bros? Haha, <laughs> are you bros mad at me? Are <laughs> Another way of saying you mad bro is are your brothers mad at me? <laughs> Lol, are your brothers mad at me? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Art thou enraged? Yeah. There's a... There's an episode of, of Black Mirror that uses the troll face, and it, like, uses it in such a weirdly effective, like, horrifying context. <laughs> Whoa! There it is! Also, yeah, the music just left. The music said, nah. Okay. Let's, how how the has a has a new bouncer? Oh God, it's, it's a, a bouncer, but bigger and louder. Oh my God, we get more nanotech. What the fuck? Oh, that really is just the bouncer. But what if we made it bigger? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That episode was really tough to watch. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna talk about it a lot because the, the subject matter is fucking intense. Um, like, it, it's good, but it's, it's not something I would ever... I, I was talking about... Um, so I've been watching The Boys, too. I've been watching really challenging TV recently, I guess. Um, but I started watching The Boys recently. I, I was talking about it on Twitter, and someone replied... 
with, a, with like a really fair thought that like totally encaps it was like it was like someone someone replied to my tweets about the boys with um the boys is like one of the one of one of my favorite shows or one of the best shows i've seen that i wouldn't recommend to anybody <laughs> i'm just like that's fucking that's totally that's it that is totally it and then, uh, yeah, that's also how I feel about that fucking Black Mirror episode. I'm like, oh, like I, it's, it's a, also up there. That's a fun time. There's a, there's a pult. Where did the music go? Hello. You want to give me that music? We'll make our <sighs> music gone. Fine. We'll, we'll make our own. Here's um. <laughs> I actually played this. Uh, <laughs> I played this in the starting soon section, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do an I'm gonna do a work in progress instrumental of a of a of a song that I've been working on in the background. Not shanty, no. It's a we're doing a I'm playing something that I made. So it's like actual music, but it, it won't be like claimed to actual music. As if, no, Sea Shanty is a great song. It's just a little meme -y and also potentially irritating if you're sick of the bit. Um, it's like dynamite. Anyway, yeah, this is a this is a this is a little little work in progress uh, preview of a song I've been working on. It start it starts out kind of quiet, so if you can't hear it, that's why. Um, how the how the hell does this work? It just sends it just sends the box over. What? What does this do? Oh oh I see I see I see I see. Just on top of it. Ugh. Then hiya. Oh 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 oh! Get me over. We 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 made our own sub level theme, yeah. Ah uh, oh shit! Why did I switch off of that? Penny Penny Pult instincts. Well, I I saw this one visually. Am I even working towards it right now? No, I'm going the fucking wrong way. What am I doing? Where is it? Ah ah! Oh ha ha ha! Okay, wait. Um, oh, this probably is gonna, not gonna work, but. No, god damn it. Wait. Shit. How do I? Oh, you know what? <sighs> Sir. Oh, no, the path, like, goes around. So if we if we go like the the way of level progress, we could probably probably reach the the pole if we just keep an eye out. This is what the dog is listening to. Um. Okay, nothing yet. Whatever. We'll just keep going. Oh shit. Do be looking kind of fresh, though. Yeah, I, lo I love it. She also, on the cat with pants one, she like hesitates. She says it with so much like care. How do we? Uh... Song slaps. Thank you. I'm I'm very excited about it. I've been working on it for the past like three days, three days or so. Um. <laughs> oh, and this is gonna bring us up, right? Because it's gonna. Oh wait, and then. This thing? Oh, shit! Oh, no. Okay.
What was the song you played during the pre-stream? This one. It's just this is the this is the version without vocals. Well, and the vocals in the other one aren't even finished in the first place, so They're essentially the same song. Oh, oh, across from here, maybe. No, ah. I, I'm just, I'm just not gonna worry about it. <laughs> I don't care. The um, the the Pult upgrades are not the most essential. Uh, it's gonna, it's gonna loop into the more ambient part. But um, we're probably about to exit the level anyway, so probably turn it off in a second. Okay, uh, this guy, this guy, this guy. Oof. Huh! <laughs> nice! We about to, about to get out? Oh. just sent you a galactic greeting. Guys, if you get this message, please meet me on my home world. Just so you know, I found my old ID badge. I'm pretty sure we can still use it to infiltrate Megacorp HQ, but you're gonna have to hurry. Oh my god, wait, is that fucking the Debbie Derryberry? Is that her name? Oh, and uh, sorry for the balloonogram. It was the only thing I could get off this point. We hope you enjoyed your galactic greeting. That Angela is quite resourceful. Yeah, she thinks of everything, doesn't she? She also appears to be in great danger. Hold on, I'm looking it up. <laughs> uh I don't I don't see her listed on on her Wikipedia, Ratchet and Clank doesn't seem to be anywhere. That, so that sounds... That sounds like Debbie. No, no, it just sounds a lot like her. That that, that sounds very much like Debbie Derryberry. Um, okay. So yeah, music's back. There we go. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, and now it's gone again. <clears throat> Alright, uh... Oh, what the fuck? Hello? Huh? Ah! Okay, hi. <laughs> Mini rockets. Drill! Blazer! Um. Okay. Holy shit! Oh my god, I was I was rearing up to, to fight this dude on the left and he just fucking exploded. Oh my god, the bouncer is crazy. <laughs> Angela Cross's actress is the same as Sally Acorn. Cool. I never I never saw that show. <laughs> I never saw uh, really any of the Sonic cartoons extensively. So it seems like that infobot. I, I, I'll, I'll admit, I was, I was too busy looking up to see if it was Debbie Derryberry to, um, to actually pay much attention. So I might rewatch that cutscene. Oh no! Don't forget the hyphen between spider Hello? and man. Hello. Snail vape donated five dollars. Uh -oh. Glad Ratchet seems to be getting over his capitalist scum boyfriend and falling for the anarchist furry girl. <laughs> uh oh. Ah, shit. It's just froze. It's just locked. Uh, I, I can't even go to the, like... 
what money gets you. I can't I can't even get to like the PS3 like quick game menu. Um Okay, uh real quick, I gotta I gotta hard reset my PS3. <laughs> Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Oh my god, yeah, it just could it completely froze up my PS3. I have to like unplug it. <laughs> Shit. If you have, like, if you love zebra cakes, but you haven't had one in a while, there's a chance it's because you had it as a kid and you remember it being better than it actually is. Because zebra, cake, zebra cakes are fine. They're, like, not bad. They're, they're not bad at all. Don't get me wrong. But, like, they're too, like, like the, the outside frosting, and I get it's, like, all processed and it has to be, like, packaged and shit, so it's, like, it has to be a little bit like this, but it's, like, weirdly, like, it's, it's more like... It's like fondue. Is that, wait, is that the, like the hard shit on cakes? It's fondue, oh God, wait. Okay, um. Oh, wait, why is it? Oh, 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 oh. okay, so. Oh, fo yeah, fo fondant, yeah, that that's what I meant. Fondue is, is the cheese, right, 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 right. Um, yeah, it's like fondant. I, I, I always get those two mixed up. They're too similar. Somebody changed that. <laughs> um, I think we're gonna have to work our way through the warehouse again. That's fine. You know, we have, we have come across greater evils. Um, yeah, it's, 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 it's more like, it's more like fondant than it is like frosting. It's like too hard. It's like too much of a barrier for me. I'm like just, Swiss rolls are like the exact opposite. They're like the most fucking like, agreeable texture in my eyes. I find Swiss rolls incredibly uh, good to eat because they're like kind of soft. Sorry, I'm adjusting volume. I'm letting this guy whack me for a second. Yeah, Swiss rolls are great. Like, Swiss rolls have like the kind of like consistency that I thought zebra cakes had when I ate them as a kid. And now zebra cakes are like way too, way too hard for me. I, I'm like scared to use the bouncer again. We, I'm like we've never had that issue before, so shouldn't be I shouldn't be so scared. But also, we did upgrade the bouncer, and now it's all fucky wucky crazy big bouncer time. So I don't know. I just put all of them in the fridge. You you you, you refrigerate. Your little Debbie snacks, Alexa? I I find that off-putting. Like like yeah, you like you can. It's just not I don't I don't get it. You like them cold? That's fair. That's fair. You know what? I like I will I will willingly and at times preferably of course, I mean, this is, I'm not fucking special for doing this. This is like a, is a common thing, but I will willingly and preferably just eat pizza straight out of the fridge. Left leftover cold pizza just straight out of the fridge without even like trying to do anything to reheat it is like the best shit. It's easier than reheating it and it's also infinitely better than reheating it. Why would you do anything else? Oh God, I'm dead. Cool. Hey, pretty fun. Like, the, the only thing that beats cold pizza is fresh pizza. Like, reheated pizza fucking sucks. Oh my god. I, this, this kind of, this, this energy is making me want to do another, um... Not that there's, like, a particularly rancid energy going on right now, but I'm, I'm about to, like, start going to on about like I'm, I'm about to start going on rants about like completely pointless shit and it's making me really want to do another um uh tearless stream that was so much fun just gotta reheat it with a mug of water at half power that's yeah but that's fucked it's again like I said though that is so much work 
com comparatively. It's like it's not it's not back breaking to you know do a reheating technique with with pizza in the microwave, but like comparatively, that is so much work for something that no matter what you do is not going to be half as good as fresh pizza and it will never be as good as just eating it cold. IMO. Because like fresh pizza and cold pizza are not on the same level as good, but cold pizza is like just underneath fresh pizza as in like good ways to eat it. And then like reheated is like five tiers down. <laughs> Okay, so I need to start using weapon variety again. I've lost my way. And by that I mean I'm just I'm just using the mini turret more from now on, if I remember. Wait, what are in the other tiers? I don't know, it's just other other good things, I guess. Yeah, just other things that are also better than reheated pizza, which is a lot of stuff. Like if you're if you're about to reheat a pizza, just get a hot pocket. It's like it's like it's an infinitely better experience. IMO. Get a get a fucking uh oh my god. The pepperoni pepperoni pizza lean pockets are like one of the best frozen things ever. <laughs> I am like always in the mood for that shit. Specifically the the pepperoni pizza lean pockets. I don't I don't give a shit about other lean pockets. Other hot pockets are okay. But Something they do <laughs> to the pepperoni pizza lean pockets is like it's a, it's addictive. Um, <laughs> where is the puke mode? Uh, I'll I'll tell you where it is. It's it's out of this stream <laughs> because I'm right. Mean pockets. <laughs> looks like it looks like someone's being mean pockets right now. That's that's funny. Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Snailvate donated five dollars. Would you ever consider doing a stream or vid where like you and Clown House PPL react to fan edits slash animations of your LPs and dubs? Or would that be too insular? Teresa a lot of funny animatics out there and ITD be cool to see y'all. Uh, Yell's reactions is how it finished. Um, I, I, I mean, it's, it's not a bad idea for sure. I just, I don't, there's not like, not that there's not a lot, but I don't think there's an, in my, in my eyes, there's not enough that like would uh, constitute an entire like streams worth of content. If that makes sense. Um, there, there is some really good shit out there. I don't know. It's, it's not something I'd be, I'd be rearing to do anytime soon in particular. Uh, but I i mean, I do fucking love uh, fan edits and, and, and animations and stuff. So like, uh, they're all very, very, very good. I, I mean, I like, and, and sometimes I just react to them on, on stream, like off the cuff, like when I, when I find them. If it's on a stream, I will, I like, I will. I'll react to something for sure, uh, every so often. I just don't know about a dedicated one. But who's to say? It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a never n say never situation, I guess. Ah! Save me.
<laughs> yeah, Kit Kitty Robbery one is great. Um, there's one that someone did of, uh... Well, it's like a... I think it's like two dub animatics, and then... It's, it's, it's like one... It's, it's like a compilation of, of, like, three different animatics they did. Two of them are dub bits, and then one of them is a, uh... Is a bit from Chase and I's Luigi's Mansion playthrough, and, like, I... I always think about that one. That is like one of my favorites, specifically the Luigi's Mansion animation, because because I, I just love that series. I would I would love to see like more animatics and animations from Chase and I's Luigi's Mansion or or oh my god, the Battle for Bikini Bottom playthroughs. Like either of those, I'm like I'm oh, <laughs> I'm in a little bit of a pickle. Shit. Uh, no, we're good. Um, I would love to see more more fan stuff from those two. Oh my god. Uh, because I, I'm just really proud of those series in particular. Oh, there actually is a, uh... Oh, I accidentally brought out these guys, and they're actually super helpful right now. Um, there actually is... I think there's, like, a couple, but I know there's... I know there's one in particular that I'm thinking of, of, like, a... of a TK Day bit. Or, or at least, like, a Tom Kenny-related bit from the Battle for Bikini Bottom playthrough, and it is so funny. He's just bringing, like, Tom Kenny, like, real-life Tom Kenny pictures in, like, PNG form. It's really good. It's really good. Okay, I gotta get through this. We, we just, we just lost a, a decent few minutes because of that, that game crash, so. Yeah, make up that time. Whew! Would love to see the RP bit done as some sort of animatic. Oh my god, me too. Fuck. God, that, that bit was so funny. It, it is so fun doing, like... Just... Just doing, like, doing <laughs> fake Your RP. Donated five dollars. That... If we're talking about favorite bits from old LPs, I'll never get over Alfred's agent bit in the Puyo Tetaki. Oh yeah, that was funny. I was gonna say, um... Oh my god, the noise. <laughs> I was gonna say there's there's nothing more fun than doing like fake LP that is so like lengthy and specific and like in depth that it just kind of in a way becomes genuine or did I say LP I meant RP that kind of just becomes genuine RP like um every so I, I Marble does this a lot where she posts like a like a funny kind of like um like RP prompt image or like open RP thread thing on Twitter and a lot of like clown house people usually reply to it including me and it just kind of like extends into this like very nearly genuine <laughs> RP experience it's but it's all it's all tinged with like a jokiness but like we do just kind of sit there for a very long time posting in this thread it's funny I gotta... I'm just gonna just put this down. Hi! Why the fuck do you do that? Hey! Hey! What the fuck is your... Hey, look at me! <laughs> no, look at me! What is your problem? No, I it said. I'm not doing that. Oh, it actually can't see them through the, the gate. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Oh, you know what? I'll... I'll just do this. Oh god, not the fucking infiltrator. <laughs> no. Oh, I forgot. I have to do... Oh, no. Oh, my God. Just fucking kill me. <laughs> Just do it. Just get it over with. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. Ah. The Orb of Obnoxious. Yeah, that's... That's the way to say it. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, okay. There's one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nope, 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 nope. No, oh, oh, no, fuck, I was so close. I saw it. I saw it. I just, I, it just like, it just didn't. I, and I pressed it too. Uh, uh, oh, there we go. Okay. All right. <laughs> I, where, where did my turrets go? <laughs> they fucking, they left when I had my back turned. Oh, I got, I got, 
uh, five hits left. You can't leave. I only did that because I thought you were going to stick around. Motherfuckers. I, I hope I... I I hope no other game does that stupid infiltrator puzzle. And I apologize to whoever designed the infiltrator traitor puzzle. If you're, you ever, by any chance, hear this, it's not personal. I promise. There's no ill will between us. I mean, unless you decide there is, that's totally up to you. I, I can't. Oh, I can't speak for you, but like, I mean, personally, there's no ill will. It just, I, I hate it. <laughs> It's just, he said to just ghost it. He said, peace. Oh, oh god, Jesus. Okay, alright. I'm stressed. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool turrets. Huh. Oh. Shit, oh my god, I... Why? Oh, we're back here. <laughs> It's okay, we won't have to do the infiltrator again. They I uh, know, stop! Stop! I'm taking care of the little dogs first. Now there's two of you. Two of them. Two of them. Get him. Sick him. Are you gonna get him? What the fuck are you doing? Thank you. <laughs> Oh my god, I... The turrets? The turrets have become shit. Goodbye, I'm replacing you with the dynamo. Why? Why? Wha- Okay... I'm not- I just- I'm not... I'm not doing good tonight. This is- this is rough. This is rough. If this is the trend, then I, I worry about our game finishing potential. That's okay, though. We're only an hour and 46 minutes in and we haven't even finished the first... We haven't even finished the first new planet that I opened up by saying, Oh, this one's small. <laughs> God. And I saw someone say there's like four planets left, so that's not that's not too bad. That that's not even all that bad. If we can just like, if we can do better than we have on this one from this point, then like we'll be fine, I think. Yeah, get him, get him, fuck him up. This is what I'm looking for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Oh, I should be using the mini rocket more. I gotta level it. This is good. This- oh, shit. Huh. No, 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 no. I have no health. There is no health. That's okay, you know what? I actually just don't even have to walk in that direction, though, right? Oh, this isn't even the... Oh, yeah, this isn't even the bullshit part with the robots. Infiltrated a puzzle dev donated five dollars. Sad face. I don't... Don't make me, don't make me pity you. <laughs> now there is bad blood. Oh, that, that max nanotech did help a lot. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> Yo, this dude worked his whole life on that puzzle. It's not my fault. Don't forget the hyphen between Spider and Mayor. Super Fun Tastico 17 donated $10. Hey, Jobra, I just want to meet the stream goal. <laughs> Thank you. 
I appreciate that. That's cool, everybody. Drop your celebratory goal emotes in chat if you so desire. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Um, we are almost out of the mini rocket ammo. That's okay. We have the bouncer on our side. Don't crash my game. I'm on donated five dollars. Wow, Betty, so rude. <laughs> I don't care. Thanks for the money. <laughs> Jokes on you. <laughs> Thank, thanks for the thanks for the Starbucks money. Whoa, what's this? Huh? What's this? You found a hypnomatic part. You need all of the parts to make the hypnomatic gadget. The hypnomatic? What the hell? Is this a what? Is this is this a was, was I supposed to have been finding other parts? Because I've not found shit. I've been I've been doing a lot of looking. I, I, I assume this is just a late game thing. Oh, this is probably similar to the... Oh, it's, it's probably just the... That's, is is that the same thing from the first game that made the prices cheaper? No, it's not? Okay. It's a surprise tool that'll help us later. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. All right, well, I'll, I'll keep an eye out, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, it's probably useless. Oh, yeah, yeah probably. This is happening. Infiltration, your puzzle dev donated $5. Hey, good point. Give me back my $5. Penny hates my puzzle, Parker. I'd, I'd like to see you try. Wait, don't actually try. Don't charge me back on PayPal. That's a really shitty thing to do. I'll I'll give it back. Just just uh just give me give me give me your PayPal email. I'll, uh, I'll you know I'll get that over to you. Uh, can someone in chat do exclamation point ratchet progress, please? Um. Okay. Uh. So. Uh. Wait. Oh. Uh, wait. I, I was going to the. Going to the ship because I would like to know which planets we unlocked and which ones. Well, they're probably both plot important. Oh, yeah, yeah, so we did unlock two. All Gone City, that's the one that was being fucked up. And then this one is, I think. Yeah, this is where Angela is. Um, okay, uh, I gotta I gotta step away for just a minute. So um I'm gonna I'm gonna go to a BRB screen. And then uh, when I get back, we will head to... I mean, it's in order here, so we'll just go to All Gone next. Uh, even though I do want to see Angela again as soon as possible. Uh, no reason why. I just, you know, she's in trouble. So, uh, but we'll go to All Gone. Just list order is easier. It's easier to make a decision. So, uh, BRB, everybody. R just, a, just, a, just, a, just a minute. Hey, I'm back. How's it going? I hope y'all didn't, uh, I hope y'all did get up to multiple crimes while I was gone. Make sure to, make sure to, to turn in your, your, your marked off crime itineraries at the end of stream today. There's a, there's a drop off box at the exit. Um, You can drop off your crime itineraries if, if you would like to keep up to date with all, or if you would like to keep us up to date with your crime activity. Okay, let's go, <laughs> let's go to All Gone City. It's just gonna, we're just gonna be flying through space. The city's all gone. Save the overrun planet, ride the train rails and explore the moon. This is probably a big level. 
Let's go. Strapping in. Planet Damozil. <laughs> Planet Damozil. Yahoo! Anon donated five dollars. So many crimes happened. We, included you, will all be arrested in five nah, hours. Ah, fuck that! I wasn't here. If I was not a part of the crimes, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm here playing a video game. How big is this map? Oh, it's not too bad. The moon is probably, it's, oh, it's probably like this. Oh, you know what? Yeah, because we got this shit, which I noticed <laughs> recently. And I was like, oh, hello, Moonstone. Hello, Moonstone. So it's, it's probably like another desert situation where like, that's really the, the main meat of the, is this how we get to the moon? Probably. Yeah, because those are like... Uh, well, I mean, we shouldn't assume. We shouldn't assume about the moon, because we'll get there soon, and we will swoon at all the stars in the great big sky. All the stars that we fly by when we're going to the moon. Da -da 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 -da. I'm gonna uh, go on the rails first. I don't want to go to the moon just yet, because that was the last thing on my to-do list. No, oh my god, it's a- oh god! Oh shit! Oh, we're actually fighting off proto-pets now. That's awesome. Finally. Oh <laughs> yeah, moon tune. That was a little moon tune, wasn't it? Entirely improvised. Real-time moon tune. Since the new... That's a new spin-off. There we go. Exclusively improvised songs about exclusively the moon. <laughs> that's that's a series with, with some fucking longevity, right? That's going somewhere. And will stick around for years to come. <laughs> Just think of the sheer amount of content you could get out of that concept. That shit would go on longer than The Simpsons! Mm. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I was <laughs> sorry, I was... I, so, okay, the context, I was panicking. Uh, oh, I died. I was panicking because I thought that was... Oh, no, I gotta do it. Oh, God, okay. I was panicking because I used my hand that's on the jump button to pick up uh, a drink to pick up my drink and take a sip while while I was grinding down that section. Um, oh yeah, we we're getting this dangerously close to the jump, and, and I hadn't put it dollars. down yet. Wow, these proto bats seem pretty easy to kill. I don't see the hassle. Cap yeah, it. she's just taking nothing. Just taking one hit, one hit from the wrench, and I I turn them into I turn them to make them proto jet away, right? And somebody's no. Hiya, hiya, hiya. <laughs> Thank you for the jet emotes. I was, I was hoping that I didn't, I didn't cut it off too, too short to make it like unreadable. I'm glad that came across like I needed it to. Um, there's a, there's a. I think one of the like, I don't know if it's a. I think it's like the gnomes. One of the gnome voices in World of Warcraft sounds fucking exactly like Marble's jet voice. I don't, I I forget if it's the gnomes or another another race, but one of one of the one of the gnome voices. There's a there was like a, a quest I was doing at one point. And I kept having to interact with this guy. He was like a—he was like an experimenter. He was making like a shitty potion or something. Um, 
And, uh, oh, hey, it's another one. Nice. Oh, look at him go! Look at him go! Ah! Sorry. <laughs> no, don't be sorry. You found a hypnomatic part. You need all of the parts to make. Was that a? Was that like a Jack and Daxter reference? <laughs> By the way, that was very Jack and Daxter. Oh, that's so. Oh, oh, it, it was intentional. That's awesome. I was like, wait a second, they don't ever do that. <laughs> That's so good. It was a sound cue too. That's so fucking, that's fun. Oh no. Stop saving tourists, yeah. <laughs> um, I was gonna say something earlier. Oh yeah, yeah, I was talking about I was talking about World of Warcraft jet voice. I know. The World of Warcraft, the thing everybody wants to hear about right now. Um No, but I was doing a I was doing a quest line and there was a character. It was like a shitty inventor and, and one of one of one of, I think it, I think one of his voice lines was like he was like, take it easy, and like he would just say that. He said it a few times, and I was like, that is, that just sounds so much like, like, real-time fan of Jet. Like, that, like, that is just, it's also just something that real-time fan of Jet would say. Take it easy! Oh my god, yeah, the proto, the, what are they, the proto, oh my god, they're, they're fucking Twonkies! They are Twonkies! They, they are exactly like Twonkies. Attack of the Twonkies took this from Ratchet and Clank. I'm officially declaring it. Where the hell do they keep? They literally are multiplying. They keep coming out of nowhere. Take it easy. <laughs> Joy's hilarious in real time fan up. Yeah, no, she's fucking great. I I'm so sad for both Joy and Devon that Until Dawn does not do shit with Emily until like the back half of the game. And then it just fucking doesn't ever do anything with Matt. Like it truly there's like one extended sequence with Matt, and I'm so I'm so mad because I was really hoping that part two would, would really balance out the mat sequences. And I'm keeping as many of them in there as possible. That is to say, the one that there is. But like, goddamn, you know? They, they really, they, they did mat. They did mat dirty in that game. Yeah, don't, don't, no, no worries though. We'll, we'll, we'll get the Vaughn on another thing and just, we'll, we'll, we'll give him a chance to just go fucking crazy. He's, he's great. He's really funny. One of, one of my favorite real time fan dub bits is the, uh, is the, oh, yeah. from the Detective Pikachu happening. practice dub we did. donated five dollars. Honey, sorry, I think I misheard you. I have bad hearing. Did you say Attack of the Twinks? No, Attack of the Twonkies. Jimmy Neutron Noob. Go watch Attack of the Twonkies. It's funny. Um, yeah, we did we did a I, I posted the clip of it on Twitter of the uh the, the Detective Pikachu practice dub where <laughs> it's uh it's it's Pikachu and, um, oh, what's his face? What's his name? Fuck. The, the kid. <laughs> the kid, the main fucking character. What, whatever his name, I can't, I, it's, I, it's, I'm completely blanking on his name, but, um, we were talking about Michael. <laughs> I just said Michael transaction. Oh my God, this fucking level. These, these proto pets, they are, they're too much. They are, they literally multiply 
And it's just, it's just, that's really overwhelming. I gotta bring out the bouncer for this. Tim. Oh, yeah, yeah, his name was Tim. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. Yeah, and they're talking about microtransactions. <laughs> just in some fucking... Did you say microtransactions? Who's Michael? Yeah, Chase is great. His fucking, uh... Him and, uh, him and Ku's, uh... Evil rap about being bad <laughs> that they posted on Twitter the other day. I, I still go back and listen to that. That shit is so funny. Okay, so this is absolutely the only weapon to use on this level, though. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. So this is the win button. Is if if we can't afford the rhino, this is the win button. I, I still live out of this. Oh, oh, I gotta, I gotta get rid of this shit. Get the fuck out of here. You are the the orchestrator of my demise. The silly, uh, uh, proto pet puking trash can. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> get out of here. <sighs> okay. I want the Rhino too so badly, but like there's no way. Cause like the goal is that this is gonna be the last stream and we don't we don't have nearly enough. There's also no like easy grinding spots like in like in Ratchet One. To be fair though, Ratchet One's grinding spot is a is a super glitch, so it's not like there's supposed to be. But now I have to play the game fairly and honestly. Damn. We're gonna run out of bouncer ammo. I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it up. Killinoids, get out of here. Or sorry, no, get in here. Like get get out of my inventory. Get in the fight is what I is kinda what I meant by that. Shit. Okay. Any health places over here? No, this is a this is a tough path. Um So those guys are up. I'm gonna... Ooh! HK-22 gun seems promising. Yeah, there we go. This one's pretty good. Oh. Nice! Nice! I, I love those those well-timed... Nanotech upgrades. Those, those do the hard good. Oh, shit. Okay. Alright, well... That's not so nice. Are they, are they coming from any specific place right now? Or were they just... No, nah, okay, we're good. Now it's just these guys. Hiya! Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Anon donated five dollars. Something I found amusing from the Until Dawn dub was that between that and Dr. Kuma, Holly has been typecasted as eccentric morally evil doctors. <laughs> yeah. Uh, when, when she comes back for one all, <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm gonna try and switch up, switch up her role a little bit. Like, it, uh, it literally, I mean, I, I didn't, I didn't cast her as Dr. Hill because he was a doctor. I, I cast her because he does a lot of monologues, and she's great at monologues. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. You were hiding from me. I didn't see you anywhere, but you were there, trying to get my ass. Um. Okay. 
Anything secret? Nope, it's just the sides of the platform. Downtown bank? Money. It's for me stuck on that bouncer. We need that shit. We need it. Can't go on without it. Uh, do we want another weapon? Oh, I can get the plasma coil. Yes. Whoa, that is not at all what I thought it was gonna, what? Huh? I, or maybe it interacts differently when there's actually enemies. We have a chance, we have a chance, hold on. Um, let me, let me put that on the quick select. Uh, we can replace the dynamo with that now. Yeah, did I do that right? Yeah, okay, cool. No, I'm giving it a chance. I wanted it, I'm giving it a chance. Uh, oh shit, oh, I'm trying to, okay. Well, it's, it's hard with these guys stealing all the, no pun intended, thunder. Oh, oh, that is good. Oh, that's just kind of a dedicate. That's a kind of like dedicated version of the um, the like electricity upgrade you can get. I thought it was gonna be more like the Tesla coil, but no, that that's more area of effect than uh, than single target. Oh shit! Okay, we're about to die again. Nice. Oh, that oh, I thought that I thought the debris was them. You look so much like debris, good sirs. Hello, what I get? What I get? Save all the turrets in the bank. Cool. Nice. We did it. We saved the tourists. <laughs> now rob them. That's right. Fucking stick them up. Oh, we actually, we can hurt them. Bye. I am actually robbing them. <laughs> hey there, partner. Arthur looking ass. <laughs> then he needs a new pair of rhinos. That's right. Oh, hello. How? I, I wonder. I mean, I'm sure the electric upgrade for the other weapons is like like technically less powerful than the the whatever the fuck plasma coil if, oh shit <laughs> stop you made me drop my croissant <laughs> Another Jack and Daxter thing? Oh yeah! Jesus Christ! Really went hard on the, the Jack and Daxter references this game. Although I guess this is technically like a reused asset. So they were probably just filling in space and we're like, hey, just fucking more Jack and Daxter, why not? People love it. I can respect it. Because we saw that at the beginning of the game. In, uh, in Clank's... It was on Clank's TV, right? That, that same image? It was like a TV or a poster or something with that same picture. 
Jesus Christ. Oh my god. I, I didn't realize there was a spawner right here. Be like, uh, Peter Parker in Spider-Man 3. He's like, where all these guys come from? I mean, uh, dumped sand out of his, out of his spider boot. That's fun. That was a funny moment. Too bad the movies is shit. Hot take, I don't think Spider-Man 3 is all that good. Feel free to crucify me. Um, hello? Oh, it's you. Oh, it's you. Oh, fucking happy 10 years to Portal 2, by the way. It's been a long time. Yeah. Ten, ten years ago, Portal 2 came out. Ten years ago today. Uh, so, it's weird. It's fucking weird, and also, it's super great. Because it's just an absolute staple of, of video games. Um, that's one of my favorite games of all time. I'm dead. Cool. Oh my god, we're back here? Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Oh, Ratchet and Clank. Classic Ratchet and Clank does not go easy with the with the checkpoints sometimes. All right, bouncer time. We should make quick work all of this. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I really um no, but I I need like a powerful kind of uh sort of straight shot single use, not or single target um. Weapon here, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep trying to upgrade the mini rocket. I need to actually refill real quick. I got a bunch of my brother experienced Portal 2 for the first time this summer, and it ruled. Oh my god, I would, I would love to know somebody who, like, who had never played Portal 2 before, and I could like, kind of share that experience with them. That would that'd be fucking awesome. I, I always say the, the closest you can get to experiencing something for the first time again is to is to join someone else who is experiencing something for the first time. Particularly with Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad... If you've seen all of Breaking Bad, show it to somebody else. If they like it, it is, a, it is an incredible experience. To watch somebody else watch Breaking Bad for the first time. <laughs> so us watching this? Oh, I mean, me playing this. I've, I haven't played these games before. So I don't, I don't know. I don't know if this. I don't know if that applies. That's what I'm talking about. At least not in my case. I had to watch Breaking Bad on two times speed since those episodes are dry. Oh my god. I couldn't disagree more. <laughs> I don't... Listen, like, you know, you do you. I'm not gonna shame you for it. I just... I don't get that. The, the, the pacing of that show is so meticulous. There's no accounting for taste, but, like, my, my taste could not be further off. Further off that, that track. Oh, for the love of God. <laughs> it's like I, I hate turning a corner and just seeing like a, a billion of those dudes out of nowhere. Uh, okay. Now, you know what? I'm gonna use Lancer. No, wait, I'm trying to level this. What am I doing? I was like, I don't wanna waste ammo, but I'm like, I'll use the ammo eventually anyway. Why not use it here and get the XP? Oh, well, that was a waste, but that was only one. Oh god. 
No, no. The cereal. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, no. I got I got to bring out the bouncer. I really you know, I want to have a fun time using different weapons here. This game and specifically this level is Oh my god, it's giving me no other choice. I have to fucking start over. Oh my god, this game, the the difficulty curve in this game is insane compared to the first game. I I like this game a lot and I really appreciate a lot of what this game does. I I think the the sheer change of scope in this game um I, I think it falls to its own ambition a little bit every so often i yes i am saying this because i'm having a hard time right now so you know take that as you will but like i i you know the, i feel like the difficulty curve in this game um i'm not adjusting to it very well it's like it feels like it kind of it feels like it was a little bit haven't gotten an armor upgrade in a while that's fair that's true but like, yeah, I, I will like I was trying to save up bolts for um, for weapons. It's like so many, so many of the things are so expensive. What the hell? What is it? Are, is is that these things? Were they making that sound before? <laughs> what the hell? Um, first game is way harder than you when you don't get the rhino. That's, oh my god, that's also totally fair. I, yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? You know what? That, I didn't even think about that. That makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, well then, you know, that could just be a matter of a little, having a little bit of a warp perspective. Because yeah, 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 yeah. I, I did totally cheese the game. I, I, I didn't even take that into consideration. I did, yeah, I had a win game button. We, we, we joked about it a ton. I, I can't believe I didn't think about that. But also, that being said, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm, oh my God. <laughs> I'm not gonna say this, uh, this game's difficulty curve is ridiculous per se, just because I, 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 I have been, you know, helpfully reminded that, like, I, I did, there were some specific factors that made the end of Ratchet and Clank 1 easier for me on um, my first go around. Um, that being said, I don't, I don't like this level. <laughs> the proto pets are really annoying. They're, they're so frustrating. Not even the Attack of the Twonkies video game <laughs> made the Twonky concept of this this fucked up. Alright, I'm gonna come out a little bit. Yes, yes, Twonkies from Jimmy Neutron. Once again, please do your Jimmy Neutron research. Jimmy Neutron attack of the Twonkies. They, the Twonkies are like exactly like the Proto Pets. They're they're the the Proto Pets are fuzzy, and that is like the only difference between the two. And I'm saying that not even fully remembering if the Twonkies are fuzzy or not. I don't think they are. They're like aliens. They have like alien skin. The Proto Pets aren't aliens. They're not. Because everyone is an alien <laughs> in this universe, so technically they're not. They're not aliens. I will die on this hill. What? Why aren't you moving? Hello? You gonna? Oh. <laughs> that was weird. All right, bouncer time. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I love my win game button. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, kill noise. Sick em. Sick em, boys.
I got, um... I got more of that, uh, that Coke with coffee stuff. And I'm, I'm drinking it right now. And... So, like, my first... Oh, we got the... It's a Therminator. Uh, the first, the first time I drank that... I posted a thread about it on Twitter, and it was like, it was like, it was, it was weird. It was mostly weird, but I like, I like, I enjoyed it, you know. Generally, it was like fine. It was like, yeah, yeah, it's, 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 it's weird, but it's not bad, right? I'm not, en I'm not enjoying it as much this time. It is just weird again. But like, I'm gonna keep drinking it because I don't want it to go to waste. I like just opened it. It's like mostly full. I really don't want to waste it, so. I'm just... <laughs> You're getting sleepy, very sleepy. Oh no! Uh, you are getting very sleepy. Ahem. Ah, a customer. You Don't fall asleep. Like someone who could use a hypnomatic. Okay. Don't forget the hyphen just between spider and man. We'll make it for free. Kato Sicarius ah, donated five dollars. Zeno scum. <laughs> Burn the heretic. Kill the mutant. Purge the unclean. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Uh, but thank you for the donation. Oh, we need one more. Okay. So this is where we go to trade. What other missions are they? Uh, oh, then we just gotta explore the moon. I think that might be Warhammer stuff. <laughs> is this the same person who's talking about Warhammer last time? I think there was someone last time who donated with a Warhammer reference. I appreciate you're into Warhammer, but I just, you know, I'm not... This is not me saying don't do it, because, you know, live your life well. Do it, do it brings you joy, but, like, I just want... I'm not gonna understand any of it. Again, that's not... It's not me asking you not to do it. That's more just a warning. <laughs> like, ev every time... Every time a Warhammer reference comes in, I'm gonna say, I don't know what that means, because I don't know what that means. <laughs> Oh, shit! Can't think of Coke Coffee without thinking of Brutal Moose's absolute odyssey with that drink in his latest vid. That's how I learned about it. God, Brutal Moose is great, by the way. Oh, man. I had a, I had a Tumblr ask recently that asked me what um what YouTube creators I, I frequent to. And I, I should have put them on the list. I knew there was other ones that I really fucking love that I was missing. Uh... Brutal Moose, big recommendation. Um, okay. Jumps, firebomb, strike, yeah. Punches, fires, missile. Okay. Destroy the mothership? This is not exploring the moon. <laughs> this is fucking destroying the moon. Although maybe... Maybe, maybe we'll... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, it's... Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I see what's going on. Maybe we'll explore the moon after we're done. Oh my god, what the fuck? Jesus. Almost dead. Okay, these these guys go down in one punch if I'm careful. These do not? What's the difference? Are they color coded? Or or maybe it was he was just already damaged from my previous run in with the missiles. Oh shit, okay. Well, just destroy some buildings. Hey, Penny, did you ever finish Luigi's Mansion 3 on your own time? I beat it last night. It's a good time. You know what? I, I never did, but pretty recently I reinstalled it thinking of doing that. Um, I don't play my Switch a lot nowadays. I, I literally... Oh my god, this shit really sucks. <laughs> this is tough. Um, I don't, I don't actively think about playing my Switch a lot nowadays. I have to, like, really, really be in the mood for, like, a specific game and only a specific game to turn on my Switch. And it has to be, like, Switch exclusive, otherwise I'll, like, play it somewhere else. Um... Like... So, yeah, so, but, like, I, 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 I would love to. I would love to play the rest of Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, I, and, you know, of course, I'm, I'm, I'm sad we never got to finish the Let's Play. Uh, it was just kind of a... a thing where, like, it, like... It had been so long, we could tell we weren't feeling it, uh, coming back to it. We tried to come back to it, and, and the episode we did coming back to it was just so trash. Like, we were not proud of that episode at all, so... So we moved on. We moved on to SpongeBob, which is, like, 
probably my favorite Let's Play I've ever done. <laughs> so I'm not mad about the decision. I think we actually made a very smart choice. This is rough. Please, please, please. Just fucking... Will you stop? This, this whole level... This whole level is comprised of encounters where I go into a place expecting to work towards something, and then they just spam a bunch of little guys on me. First with the proto-pets, and now with these guys. I'm just like, I'm trying to find the fucking mothership so I can do what I'm, what I'm here to do. What do I, where, uh, god, oh my god. <laughs> Why are you coming from all sides? You are coming from all sides! You think you're half my health! I barely even have time to react before half of my health is gone. That is ridiculous. And and you can't even say it's an armor thing here because Clank doesn't get armor. <laughs> it's just, they just bombard you with this. From all directions. Okay, okay. Hey. Fuck you. No, are you serious? He, like, he comes over to... He comes over briefly. Yes. Fuck, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> Finally. I got some health off of him. I feel like I've truly overcome my woes. Oh. Oh, okay. Alright, whatever. Take it. Take the, take the fucking, <laughs> take the <laughs> Ratchet and Clank 2, or how I learned to stop, fuck! Ratchet and Clank 2. <laughs> stop! <laughs> your problem is somebody, can somebody put these guys down for <laughs> Jesus Jesus Christ put these guys down for a nap give him some fucking apple juice please hello dude 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 what the hell Am I even supposed to do? <laughs> Where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? No. Fuck off. Fuck off. He's coming from the... <laughs> you can't. The knockback is just insult to injury. Just don't die. Oh, thanks. Cool. We'll... I'll fucking keep it in mind. I'll j jot it down on today's memo. Fucking hey Siri, remind me to not die. Freaking Reddit exclamation point remind me 12 hours, don't die. I, I, I don't even have two seconds to get a hit on it before it leaves. Thank you for the singular... No! Fuck you! <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! Leave! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! I wanna go to the fucking... I'm gonna go to Macy's! Get out of my way. I'm going to Macy's. Get out of my way. Let me true. <laughs> they did. They're letting me go to Macy's. Cool, thanks. Are you, <laughs> you fucking serious? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Bomb. No, get get bombed. There's one coming from behind me. Cool. Okay. I'm I'm so stressed. I I I, I was like, okay. I gotta do more jumps. Nope. Okay. Jumps are too slow. Sound like uh. Robo Spongebob. 
No! Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> Gotta admit, these guys have a great security! You're right! I should be thanking them for keeping their wares so safe. For all the value customers who want to come in and buy a fucking proto pet on the moon? <laughs> I don't even know what the moon is no! here for. Here, Kasa donated five dollars. Robot fishes be like fuck you and Macy as yours. <laughs> Robots be like fuck you kills you. I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take I'll take it, I'll take any I'll take fucking anything. Thank you. Alright. Okay, no. No shit. I can't turn around quick enough. They can, just, they can just flank me all they want, and I can't I can't I can't do anything about it. Huh. This is fine, this is fine, this is <laughs> breaking through the Oh god, give me help, give me help, give me help! I'm breaking through the buildings, yeah, alright. Cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. What am I where am I going? Here. No. Hey. Get bombed. Shit. I'm I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna die. Give me help. Oh, huh. <laughs> Just let me through. <laughs> Just let me through. Just give me some help. I give me I need any help that isn't just like the fucking Oreo thins cookie crumbs of health, please. No, 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 I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Oh god, okay. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh no, he got stuck! No, no, no! <laughs> I'm dead. Oreo thins are pretty good. Yeah, they're my favorite kind of Oreo. They're just small. Okay. I am following this fucking ship. Doing like the Hulk. Doing like the Hulk does with his jumps. Is it not? Is it just not gonna slow down when I'm following it like this? Do I have to take care of this guy? Please. Please. <laughs> Oh, the rafters. Hey, get over here, motherfucker. Where do you think you're going? It's just not... It's just not gonna do anything. Okay, maybe if I stay up here, they can't fucking... Uh... Well, I can't shoot them with the missiles if I'm up here. <laughs> fucking stuff! This is Mario, these bitches. Whoa, okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> Wait, can he just do, do like little, little midair hops? Yeah, this is how you do it. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. This is how. We, oh, oh, oh! Get it! Fuck you, get it! <laughs> this, is, this is too much. Oh no, we had a chance. God damn it! It's all right. It's all right. Alright, this is the strat, this is the strat. This is the strat. <laughs> She's beginning to believe, yeah. Finally, hope has been restored to Townsville. Oh, huh. Come on. Oh, it's really... I, but, the, okay, so the problem with this strat is that I'm so mobile. <laughs> I'm so viciously mobile with this strat that it becomes harder to stop in time to do a substantial amount of damage, but I have I have done more damage on this ship than ever, and I've taken less than ever. So you know what? This is it. This is the strat. We're, we, we just got a Mario. <laughs> do the Mario! Oh, oh, oh. I'm the Mario. 
plank in air and jump real high. Come on, it's time to go kill the fucking robots. Uh. about I, I always think it's gonna go like a million miles away because then when I don't think it's gonna go a million miles away it does but then when I do predict that it takes like two seconds and it's like actually I'm gonna stop here I'm tired this oh my god it's taking forever but this is the only way to do it come on come on come on stand still fuck Shit. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Does it like... Does it like respawn... Oh my god! Wait, it respawns robots after like... A specific amount have died, I think. So if I just like... If I can take a second every so often... To like just kill a bunch when I'm next to the thing... Like if there's like a group of them when I'm next to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, like this, like this. And I just do this... It'll spawn more, right? Oh shit. Oh my god, what are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Hello? Okay, all right. Well, it's doing something else now. Okay, well, th yeah. I had a strat, but it's not gonna work for this phase of the fight. Phase two. Give me those bombs. I guess maybe this is like phase three. Did I just miss phase two? I'm just too busy dying. Oh god, okay, alright, alright. No, shit, stop it! <laughs> Fucking serious. <laughs> How the fuck am I supposed to dodge that? Oh, we're so close. I can't die on this one. This took so long and we're so close. Okay, this is it. This is how we do it. There's some very convenient scaffolding all across the way. We're just gonna... I don't have anything. I forgot missiles are. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Oh, and then. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Eat it. Eat it for breakfast. Eat it for breakfast. Eat it for your fucking. Break fast. Break your fast with uh, my foot in your ass. Yes! Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. So. <laughs> Worst level of all time. Assume is another, um, the mapper reveals secret areas. Oh, actually, very secret areas, are very helpful. Actually, green. yo, 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 that's actually super good. That's a really that's a good thing. Oh man, okay, um, return to park dome. That's this area over here, right? Because then if we, like, go this way, we could probably see about that little secret area. Hope it was worth it. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, it was absolutely worth it. Shit rules. Okay. Um. What is, uh... What's this all about? I guess we maybe have to get the hypnomatic for that. <clears throat> oh shit, okay. Huh! <laughs> I, was just, I just gotta go! Uh, yeah. 
think he'll go plat bolt hunting off stream with this now um <laughs> truth truth be told when i go platinum bolt hunting off stream i don't really hunt i i mostly just do a walkthrough this this helps though it does help in, in the moment on stream when i don't use a walkthrough Oh, is it this? It's next to the bank? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's this all about? What is the secret area? Oh, oh, I think I, I think I under, uh, I maybe kind of understand. Let's try. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. <laughs> Oh, that's really cool. Oh, you ran like a grind, a grind rail. Bolt time. That's really cool. Mm. Okay, we are nearly three hours <laughs> into this stream. I feel like I'm, I'm just not even close to beating this. We gotta go. <laughs> I, I don't want to stay up forever. I might commit to to going as long as it takes to finish the game. Mostly just because I came in with that expectation and I, I would be really sad to not follow through on it. We're gonna, oh, return to ship. That's where we need to go. Yeah, well, I mean, like, we're done with this planet right now. At least until we come back with the extra hypno part. Um, so, like... Someone said there were four left before we started the stream. Or, like, before we started playing. So that's... I mean, that's two down. So... If, if that person was being... was correct. Of course. So... We'll see. We'll see. Um, but let's, uh, let's go save... We, we did do everything. Except, yeah, except for the hypno stuff, we did we did everything. Cool. Um, let's go find Angela. Love Grell, but it's your favorite planet. Cool. I'm uh, excited to see it. I really love these these vista shots that start the level. That 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 one in particular was very pretty. I love I love this this whole little these ice structures. <clears throat> okay, um mini rocket. Oh, by the way, do we get do we unlock another No, we didn't. Shield charger. What is this force field technology at its best? Protects you fully and also damages opponents who touch it. Uh, that is, that does seem really useful. Oh, you know what? Rather than spending my money on that, I'm, I'm gonna leave Grelvin for just a second. Cause you know what I'm gonna do? I am gonna go in and get a uh, an armor upgrade. If we can afford it. I actually don't know if I spent too much of my money on weapons and stuff to afford it. Where's that shit again? It's at the... It's not the armory. It's, is it... I think it's Thug HQ. Does, any, does anyone know what planet that's on? The, the, or I, I know there's like multiple ones on each planet, but there's one that's like right next to the ship. Oh, it's a testing facility. Right, 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 right. There's also one on Grelbin. Fuck. <laughs> well, better safe than sorry. And also, I mean, this one's right next to the ship, so we'll just we'll, we'll pop out, grab it, go back. No, not no time at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. How much is it? Oh shit. <laughs> we don't even have it. Oh wait. Oh no, we do have enough for an upgrade. Just not the. Oh my god. 
Oh, is this a... Uh, is this the pre-order bonus armor for Rift Apart? Oh, 90% of all damage. Uh, invisible electromagnet pulse to deflect and absorb up to 66%. What is this one? Zero plate armor uses double thick. Double thick. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, and, and it's fine. It's fine. Oh, that just drained. That drained our, um, our bolts, though. We are gonna come across a fucking plot important part where we need to spend like 50,000 bolts in a single go and it's gonna be like, why, why did you buy the armor, you fucking dumbass? It was better than nothing. Yeah, no, it's still an upgrade. We're not compromising anything except the money. <laughs> it is an HEV suit. Oh my god, I can't believe I- Oh, I can't believe I, I didn't think to add Half-Life to the recent uh, stream game poll that I did. Wow. That's my bad. I totally- I, I forgot to add that shit. Um... Okay, wait. So... Let's go across. Oh, this is where we get the moonstone, by the way, I think. I saw a little crystal thing. Yeah, there it is. Uh, that's all about. This is <laughs> I love the scenery. This is nice. Hell yeah. Oh, hey. Oh, it's you. Oh, no, you're a different guy. I thought... Or... No, you're not a different guy. You're the same guy. Can you move this rock, sir? I am able. And? Patience, young one. For the rock to move, the forces of the universe must align. So, can we make these forces align a little faster? Ah, yes. The holistic resonance of moonstones may yet guide these wayward forces. Okay, uh... Moonstone? Oh, God! <laughs> Who's that? Trade nine moonstones for rock removal. Hello! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, you're probably the big enemy that gives me moonstones when I kill you, right? Like the floating guy in the desert? No? Oh, no, you're just a... Abominable shit man. <laughs> Oh, fuck, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Look, sometimes I say things, and I don't always know, I don't always say what I mean, alright? I don't always mean what I say. An elephant's faithful. <laughs> 100, elephant, elephant, big elephant. Holy shit! Oh my god. Oh my god, these guys are not, these guys are not fucking around! Oh my god! Oh, holy shit! Oh god! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, uh. <laughs> what the fuck? Bouncer, oh, save me! Bouncer, save me! Oh god, oh god. Uh, uh. Holy shit. No, stop. Stop. I have to go back and get the other one. Oh, wait. Was that the one I just got? It may have been the one I just got. Fuck off. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> I leveled shit up in this place. Yeah, I can. Oh, Jesus. I can tell. I can see how. Oh my god! <laughs> they do not. They they do not relent. They are relentless, without relent. Yeah, it's funny. funny how last last level, I was I was saying like, ah, this, this game really just throwing on mobs of enemies, huh? And 
here we are. There are four more of these? Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god, the bouncer tears through those guys. That's good. It's good to know. I got the shield generator on this planet, I just remembered why, <laughs> yeah. I I am glad I took that detour. I'll, I'll, I'll say that much. I'm I'm about to I'm about to eat it. I'm about to fucking eat it. Might as well call this a summer brunch meal because I'm about to eat this shit. I really don't like it. Don't see the appeal. Really fucking hate this shit. Nah, nah, nah. Don't like getting swarmed by all these funny guys with snow feet. Thank you. Okay. That's the last one we are getting the hell out of here. This place, unlike the desert, which is pretty chill, really wants you dead. Yeah, I mean, like, there's, there's, there's enemies in the desert. You know, they can, they can hurt you for sure, but oh my god, this, this place is just like, this, this is just, this is, uh, this'll, this'll get you down. I know that Snow Planet will get you down. Things don't quirk, work yeah. out quite the way the that you thought. Stones is most Feeling like all your best days are dead. Moment that I am able to move the rock. <laughs> Gee, what a coincidence. Thank you, sir. That was most helpful. Your gratitude is comforting, child. Gratitude. I have also found a piece of something called a hypnomatic. You may have it in exchange for more moonstones. Wait. I thought you had no need for material possessions. Please, do not lay your burdens upon me now. <laughs> I am weary from lifting the rock, and I must pray. In other words, shut the fuck up! <laughs> kind of ironic for the coldest planet to have absolutely no chill. Hey, <laughs> You get the laugh track. Use it wisely. Um... Yeah, and I have this whole area right here. Jesus Christ. A oh, secret spot. Huh, okay, uh... No, we're headed this way, though. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What, what is, what is this? It's just like a... A bonus path, I guess. Enter the mine shaft. Huh. Oh, I see. Oh, a glider section. Nice. These, these are these are pretty fun. I like these. Controls are... They, they can be tough, but... It's tough love. <laughs> like in Minecraft! Scoop! Is, is, I guess, the voice I was doing. So like you mean like in Minecraft Scoop? That's right, Bracky. Like in Minecraft. <laughs> Scoop, dude, I think I saw a creeper. <laughs> Reaper creepers, Raggy. <laughs> my shaggy voice is like fine, but my Scooby voice is like just fucking just stop. Just stop trying. Hi infiltrator. Oh you're you're a bonus area, so you're probably gonna really just make me wanna just 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 just, you know, say some choice words about you. Yeah, 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 yeah. No problem. No problem. No problem. I get it. You know, you're doing your own thing. It is what it is. It's, uh, it's the fucking, uh, bullshit. It's... I just fucking, I deflated like a balloon. I just fucking deflated like a balloon. You just saw me. Just, I just, all over the floor. Like a balloon. Oh, that wasn't too bad. <clears throat> Like a like a balloon wonderland, wonder world. Sorry, it's 
In my heart, it's Wonder Wonderland. I gotta do that Let's Play soon. I don't wanna. I don't wanna miss out on the game's relevance. I just. I haven't had time to record a solo Let's Play. Nor have I actively wanted to play Bell in Wonder World. Shit. And I also don't. I don't wanna make it. A, I don't know. I, I think if it takes too long to do a Let's Play, I might resign to making it a stream series, but I didn't want to make it a stream series right away because I don't want it to take up a slot when I'm already... I'm already supposed to do a lot of games that I actually want to play. <laughs> Ryan wants to speedrun the game. God... I was going to say God bless. No, God rest his soul. <laughs> He's already dead. But there's a light shining deep inside me. Those fears and doubts, so just squash them and let it shine for all the world to see. It is time, yeah. It's time to be awesome. I, I sang a little bit of that song a few minutes ago, and now it's stuck in the old noggin. You've no idea how hard it's been. I wonder, um, what if the plasma coil upgraded is like particularly good? Hey. Hey. <laughs> Having a good time? No. Sorry. Plasma coil is pretty hard to use, but I think the upgrade is really worth it. Okay. I'll, uh, I'll, <laughs> I'll throw it in general rotation. I was just, I, the, the way my brain connects seemingly, like, just non-specific things to, like, references to things that I just really, it's not, like, valuable to reference. Like, I was, I was gonna say throw it in the rotation. I mean, I did say it, so I was, I was thinking of saying throw it in the rotation. The words throw it in, which somewhat sound like throw it on, made me think of Ratatouille. <laughs> Where Emil says, well, throw it on the pile, I guess, and then we'll... Uh... And Remy's like, we're not gonna throw this in with the garbage. This is special. Yeah, we, we gotta cook this. You know? <laughs> The famous scene from Ratatouille where Remy says, we gotta cook this. Jesse, we're not gonna just stick this on the pile. We've gotta cook this. You know, Mr. Wife, you really like that mushroom. You should just, you know, throw it on the pile. And we'll take it back home to dad. He's not gonna like seeing you walk that way, Mr. White. See, I don't want... Do you think about all the places we put our feet? I don't want to think about where I've been walking when I eat. You need the hypnomatic here. Once Fuck! you've found all of its parts, you'll have to go to another planet. Wait. And then... Oh, 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 oh! Hypnomatic part. I, I just did not even realize that's what we're... Train stones for. Oh my god, we gotta do uh we gotta do more of this shit. <laughs> Bounty 
Adventure time. Um. Oh, hey. Oh, it actually shows them on the map when you have the secrets upgrade. That is so, that's so nice. That's so nice. Thank you very much. Bouncer, save me. Bouncer, save me. Killanoid, save me. <laughs> Holy shit! Stop. Big guy incoming. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I can recognize uh, poppable ice covers. Thank you. Thank you. How many do we need? The brief moment of auditory respite. Drink it in, folks. We need 16 of these bitches. Oh, shit! Oh, God. I wasn't looking right. You snuck up on me. My my PS3 is gonna explode. <laughs> this game is gonna explode. My PS3. Hello, 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 hello. Hello. The camera's fucking broken. They, I can't see shit. No, okay, I fixed it. I fixed it. No, god damn it. Okay. Alright. No, that, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Forget you run away super fast with your boots. You're right! Oh my god, I totally fucking forgot about the- Oh my god. I forgot. I forgot I had those. Wow. Oh, that actually really- that actually helps a lot. Shit. Okay. I have not used those once this whole stream because I completely forgot. Well, that might, yeah, that one's one of my favorites. But there's a lie. I saw like a there was like a tweet recently cuz it was it was another it was another take that that really wasn't all that important for anyone to say but like you know everyone on Twitter has to have a take about something right so like it was it was someone was just like you know vines were never as funny as people thought <laughs> it's just like what the fuck are you talking about yeah, there were some really Anybody stupid vines, but a lot doors. of them were genuinely Good funny. Lord, Penny, I think I can hear the microchips melting across Twitch. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's a thing. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, but like, it's just one of those things where it's like, are you just, you're just like, you're really just intentionally, you know that this is like a destructive, not, not destructive. What's, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, it's like a, it's, it's just like a, it's just a thing to say that you know is gonna like, st like start some discourse, and that in and of itself is like a fucking like it's like a dopamine hit of just like <laughs> look at look at what I said and look at how people reacted to it. Yeah, I'm like I don't baiting is not the word I'm looking for. It's just like it's it's one of those um inflammatory, not reductive. What the hell? Uh, inflammatory is not particularly the word I'm looking for, but it kind of gets across the same idea. It's just like, yeah, it's like a, it's just like a very, like, performatively inflammatory kind of take where it's like, yeah, okay, if you don't find Vines funny, that's fine. It's just like, why the, why are you framing this as like a, uh, you know, <laughs> like, what, what, what? Disruptive, that's the word. Fucking Morse Mortis, thank you. You absolute genius. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, no, that's exactly the word. It, just an intentionally disruptive thing to say that like, 
it's not it's not constructive it's not constructive it doesn't mean anything you're not helping anybody much less yourself and you know th this is a very dramatic way to talk about a, a tweet that said vines aren't funny which is like in and of itself like in the grand scheme of things that that take isn't necessarily gonna hurt anybody you know i'm not saying that but like it's but like it, i it's 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 a small example of like a larger culture on Twitter that is so frustrating to me that like most people assume that just because they want to say something that it needs to be said, right? Which is like one of the most destructive ideas you can have when interacting with people or like in any sort of social space. Like like the, the filter just comes completely off for a lot of Twitter and it's like individually certain things are not the most harmful things to say but there, there's, a, there's a spirit to it that contributes to a larger problem I think um, it's just annoying <laughs> it's just an, and it's like and that, that kind of thing in particular is so like needlessly pretentious as well the vine thing specifically where it's like did you not like like, I maybe saw some, like, shitty music vines or something. You're like, people like this? But, like, like, it's fucking, like, yeah, comedy subjective. But, like, clearly, there's a lot of really good vines with, like, a genuine sense of, like, comedic craft to them. And that's, that in and of itself is, like, a pretentious way to talk about vines. Because, like, yeah, they're, like, funny six-second videos. But, like, it's just, like, some of them are really fucking funny. There's, like, a, why, why diminish that? Anyway, it was just a free teleport back to the beginning of the level, actually. That's the best thing that could happen. Thank you so much. Let's get the, uh, let's get the part. Uh, hello? We've got more moonstones. No, you have not. What? Existence <laughs> is a lie. Shut the fuck up. Take them. are illusions. Possessions are merely vision. All right, I've got an illusion of some moonstones. I'll trade it for a vision of that hypnomatic part. You have learned much, young one. Now bring me more moonstones, and riches shall be your reward. Hey, nice. Free bolts. Uh, yeah, yeah. The, the, the take I was talking about was actually, it was specifically, it was something I felt, it was specifically framed within the context that they were comparing it to TikTok and essentially saying that like TikTok is better because the videos are longer and so people can be more creative. But like, one, it's not fucking how it works. Two, th there is, yes, there was just as much trash on Vine as there is on TikTok. And trash is like a very personal, personally tinted term. I don't mean to imply that anything is like, if, like, if you like something, fucking go for it. It really doesn't matter. Um, but like, there's just as much like garbage on TikTok as there was on Vine, right? And there's also like just as much good shit on TikTok as there was on Vine. It's like a very like, they're they're very similarly, they, they're platforms with similar energy, right? Because it's people just like making short like snippets of shit that either make them laugh, make other people laugh, or are like, you know, just like a personal sort of like, scrapbook kind of thing or like you know they're using it to sort of like share a message of some kind like it's it, they're very similar they're very similar um and vine had more of a limitation so you know people can people actually can be more constructive on a platform like tiktok i think because the videos are longer so you can say more you know if you wanted to say something really important on vine like six seconds is not the place to do it but like um but also in terms of like creativity the limitation of six seconds gave way to a lot of really funny st What was I saying? We have to do more. Uh, we don't, I, we actually have 10,000 bolts. Thank like, I'm so glad we have that much, but that I'm worried. I'm worried there's gonna be a big one. <laughs> We're not gonna have enough. Anyway. Use it wisely. Do not even think about it. To use the hypnomatic, target a receiver bot and press circle to take control of the robot. Oh. <laughs> oh, interesting. What the hell? <laughs> Yo, this is fun. 
Hey, pretty cool. Beautiful. All right, where are we going? It's just wait. What did that? What did that actually do? I'm I'm confused about what that actually did. That just take it. Just make a taxi. What? <laughs> Nothing. It's <laughs> just the tutorial. Okay. Oh, the hypnotist locked you in. Got it. Okay. Sorry, I I must have missed that. I was too busy talking about uh, social media and video platforms. Oh yeah, this is happening. Oh god. A cat donated five dollars. <laughs> I, the... I glanced meow. at the message and meow. said shit. Meow. Meow. Uh -huh. meow. 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 What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? A fucking cat? Hey, don't fucking look at me like that. That's a weird looking fucking cat. Ma! Yo, there's a stray cat outside. I don't want it starting a fight with Lucy. Lucy, it's okay. It's okay, Lucy. Don't worry about it. Ma! Thank you, a cat. <laughs> All right, back to it. <laughs> Ma! I don't want to start in a fight with Lucy. <laughs> Looks like grandma the fucking thing. <laughs> uh. You know, okay, so like, you know, I, I 100% fully supported and still do support, uh, Sophie's need for a break. She's got a lot of shit going on. I am, <laughs> I'm a little sad. So it feels like my, I, I started to really, really enjoy my streams and some of the bits I do on streams right when she needed to take a break from snap streams. <laughs> like, I feel like I've done like some of my best shit since she took a break from snap streams. <laughs> if, if you're if wondering, oh, oh, wait, wait, hypnomatic, right, right, right. If you're wondering why there hasn't been snap streams lately. That that that's why it's because Sophie. <laughs> Sophie's been doing some real life shit. Oh my god, please. Donated five dollars. Oh god. Donated five dollars. Donated dollar five. 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 Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the five dollars. Can we please not make this happen? Oh, yeah. This <laughs> please, is please. I'm so <laughs> dog donated five dollars. Bark. Bark. It's bark. Bark. It's funny bark, one time. Bark. 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 Mm -hmm. Bark. Okay, thank you. <laughs> it's funny one time. <laughs> Press circle to shoot enemies. To exit the robot, press triangle. Oh. Oh, you can do multiple upon multiple. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, I forgot I can attack. I can see. I can fight. Yeah, Sophie's dealing with the government. That's what she's 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 dealing with right now. This government shit. Oh 
Oh yeah! This is happening! Here, Kasa donated five dollars. <laughs> no spam, just love. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate that. Oh, no, I'm not gonna- <laughs> Sorry, I mean to try to kill the only other guy that can get me across the gap. Alright, here we go. That'll do it. This is a, this is a interesting kind of mechanic to introduce so late in the game. You know? This this feels like the kind of thing they would give you like pretty early on and then they would use like across the levels. Why the fuck? It's interesting. They love introducing new mechanics. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure. But it's, it's like this kind of thing specifically, I, I feel like is something they, they would have otherwise I don't know. It's just, it's just it's funny. Not a criticism. It's just funny. He ha ho ho. Yahoo! Megacorp donated five dollars. This spam is sponsored by Megacorp. Megacorp. <sighs> Megacorp. Megacorp. That is all the money we have for a spam message. Thank you and have a mega day. Fuck you, Megacorp. Just to, I, I do want to be, I do want to be clear. I feel like there's a, li a little bit of will they, won't they energy right now <laughs> with the donation spam thing. Um, this is this is not a funny Bubsy situation where I'm like hee hee ha ha, no no Bubsy intro, funny funny laugh hee hee ha. Like I <laughs> I genuinely do not think it would be pleasant to hear. A stream of constantly repeated text-to-speech phrases. <laughs> it's a won't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Donations are appreciated, of course, as always. But again, this is this is kind of the thing I was talking about. This is kind of the balance we have to strike with um, enjoying the features of the donation, but also it do it does kind of risk becoming like a like a, like a chat playground, <laughs> in a way that's like, it's it's like fun and it's understandable, but sometimes I it it can compromise the energy a little bit. Whoa! A cat donated fifty dollars. Oh Teddy, shit! I am Ma, sorry for the that. The cat got that. bills. Here is my penance tax. No, it's all good. Like I said, it was funny one time. <laughs> it was so. You know, the initial one is to totally chill. Uh, that was that was funny. I enjoyed it, and also I got to make a pretty good joke out of it too. So like, you know, all all's well that ends well. I'm I'm just I you know it's one of those things you got to be a little bit straightforward about because like on a comedy stream, it can sometimes be a little bit hard to tell if the energy is like for or against something if you're not just like super clear about it. <laughs> Redemption arc. Hey, Hi, Angela. Nice digs. Yeah, it's a little remnant from my previous life. You were reincarnated? No, no, my Megacorp days. They've got a very generous bonus package. Uh, right. So now that you've got your ID badge, how do we take out the proto pet? Watch this, mommy. Where do protopets come from? Why, they come from Megacorp, dear. That's right, Mrs. Robot. All of the protopets in the galaxy come from right here in our factory. Your little friend is lovingly extracted oh, from God. the original protopet. Each protopet is given a name and birth certificate that is unique. Our training system helps mold your Jesus. pet into a wonderful <laughs> friend that you'll cherish forever. No wonder so they're off the shit. Your child asks, "Mommy, where do protopets come from?" You can answer with confidence. 
They come from Megacore. Wait, is she tall or is that he just tiny? Why not both? Porque no los dos. All the others. Exactly. If we can take out the original protopet, that'll shut him down permanently. Whoa. Okay. Twenty percent off a complete service at Groovy Lube. Oops. Oh yeah! <laughs> this is happening. A non-donated five dollars. Oh, yeah. This is a universe voice giant woman. I'll meet Thank you. There. you. Sure you want to split up? Well, Megacorp's orbital defenses are nasty. With two ships, there's a good chance at least one of us will get through. Good thinking. Just be careful. Right. All right. Uh, so this is either the last planet or real close to it. Enter ship. Oh, this is for the... This is for crystal mining. No thanks. Her house is dirty as fuck. We don't judge. I don't judge. My house sucks right now. <laughs> you know what? It's, it's a free free trip. Free. Oh wait, no, it's not. Fuck. Okay, I'm mad now. <laughs> My living space is dirty. I'm just stating facts. Yeah. Oh, I gotta, I gotta take like, I gotta take, I gotta take like a dedicated week off at some point and just like, just go, just go through, just take care of some shit, you know. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm running on empty when I'm not like actively doing something work related. It feels like so like I, I never. Well, not never, but I don't often have energy to like truly like tidy up. I kind of just like, it's like it's like in terms of tidying up my my apartment, it's like I'm like laying down the tracks in front of me as I'm riding on the like in the minecart, you know. <laughs> I'm just like, uh, 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 oh god. Okay. Um. Breaking a megacorp headquarters. Let's go. Even simple cleaning can be daunting sometimes. Well, yeah, I mean, like, I'm... Uh, I'm I'm very suspicious that I I, I have undiagnosed uh, ADHD, which, which doesn't make it any easier. I'm also unmedicated in terms of, like, any sort of, like, neurological shit. That's a, that's a crunchy percussion sound in the music. I, I almost thought it was an forget the hyphen audio glitch. And man. Popeye's donated five dollars. Existence is Popeye's chicken sensations or Popeye's chicken possessions are merely <laughs> Popeye's chickens. Damn. Thank you, Popeye's. I thought your ADHD was confirmed. No, I- it's- it's- it's not something I ever suspected I had until... Uh, until the last, like, year or so, where I started to... Well, one, I started to really, like, look into certain things that I, I deal with on a regular basis. And also, I- I started, um... Coming across, like, videos... Oh, oh, the fucking the thing. Oh, I imagine this is like the last level. They just introduced a new thing. Um, I'm replacing the. Uh... Uh, we're not gonna really have all that much time to upgrade this. So I'm replacing the plasma coil with the hypnotic. Oh uh, yeah, I started watching. Um, specifically, there's a channel named uh, How to ADHD that I started coming across a lot of her videos and also similar videos and stuff like that. And I started like kind of listening to the experiences and stuff and comparing to my own experiences. I'm like, oh, wait, oh, oh, wait, <laughs> this is what the fuck. There's, there's shit. There's there, like, there's things for this. Like, this is something you can actually like talk about and is like a shared experience and like also there's a chance to like utilize resources to get help with it what the fuck I, I just I started to realize I related to a lot of the 
symptoms and um, a lot of the experiences. Um, I notice I, I just have like a lot of issues with focus, even when I have the the best intentions and every every intention and every expectation in the world to do certain things or uh, take care of certain responsibilities. And like you know, it's not I don't I don't revel in not doing things. You know, like I it's 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 like I don't I don't revel in the I, I mean unless it's like you know either. Is like like, a, like taking a break from work or something, but like I don't I don't revel in the idea of like wanting to do something or needing to do something and not being able to do it, like that sucks, right? And so I'm like, well then why the fuck does it happen so much? Because clearly, it's not for a lack of care. Because I I I care so much. <laughs> I care, I care. I think more than anybody, I'd even be like disappointing by not doing certain things every so often, you know? Like it it sucks. So. I was like, well, that's a thing I relate to a lot when it comes to like, 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 like executive function issue. I truly believe I, I have issues with executive function because I know that I give a shit. I like, I really, like, I truly, there's no other way to explain how much it fucking sucks to like be unreliable to myself or to others or like to, um, like make, make poor decisions in terms of like productivity or like time management and stuff. So like like if it if it sucks so much and I've tried so many times to take care of it, like what what else could it be if something like just com if not something completely involuntary, right? Because like I've done everything I can think of to mitigate that issue. Like ev like every like every so often I'll try a new thing. Like like I'll have a cleaning so like I tried a cleaning schedule for my house, going back to the subject of cleaning. I was like, okay, I'll do a certain thing every day of the week and then like uh, take like two days off um, just so that I give myself a break and I'm not constantly doing this shit. Like, you know, like on Mondays, I'll do like the, Mondays I'll clean the office and like Tuesdays I'll, I'll clean the bathroom, stuff like that. Like just really, really simple things. And I did it for like a week and it was really helping and then I missed it like one time and everything just completely fell out of whack. I was like, no, I gotta jump, I gotta jump back on the horse. And then it just didn't work. And so I was just like, wait, but like I wanted to do it again, right? Like I, I was telling myself, I'm like, tomorrow I'll do it. Tomorrow I will do it, right? So like, yeah, so I was like, I really relate to the experience of like having so much intent and so much care and just not like the the part of my brain that connects to the part that makes me do things is just fucking like just it's not i don't want to use the word broken because that's like that's that's a negative connotation but like it's it's just it's 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 out of whack in terms of like operating in a way that that keeps me like like productive and and healthy and stuff so um these things these things are fucking they take a lot of shit take a lot of hits oh my god um, so there's that, and, you know, just, like, general focus issues, uh, general demotivation, um, uh, experiences in, like, relationships and, and that kind of stuff was also something I kind of, I was, I was clued into, and I was like, oh, yeah, I kind of, I relate to this a little bit. It's, it was, so it was just one of those things where it's like, I, I'm not, I'm not fully confident, you know, because, like, there are a few things that could be explained by different things or, uh, you know, other... Or, or maybe I'm just not fully understanding, like, the symptoms like I like I, I think I am. So, you know, it's, it's something that I want to get, like, professional help with because I don't want to be claiming something's going on that isn't... Because uh, I, I, I guess it's maybe not consciously, but I guess it's maybe subconsciously a fear of, like, Oh, am I just saying this because it's an excuse? Which, like, I know, I know it's not. But like, I also, I don't, I don't want to. I don't want to fully, confidently say that I have a certain thing if I don't, if I'm not certain, because I'm not. So like, I do want to like look into it, and I've been, I've been reaching out. Um, I actually need to. Oh, it's, you know, it's Sunday, so they wouldn't have got it back to me today anyway. So I want, I, I need to. If I'm, I, I emailed, like, the clinic. That I that I go to 
care, and I was like, hey, you know, help me out with this. And uh, they haven't got back to me yet. If they don't do it tomorrow, then I'll, I'll have to call them because I, I do need to. I just, I, I just wanna I just wanna work towards like dealing with it, you know. You for sure there is something there. Well, yeah, and I mean like even just like I I it's something I never really th I thought I was just fucking weird, you know, when I would like. When I would take note of like how I talk about things or like how I um like really like lose my my sense of direction in like conversations and stuff and like uh like you know on streams I all the time I will I'll do this thing where I'm talking about something. I'm I am almost positive I'm doing it right now, by the way. I I'm not actually entirely certain, but I swear I I I would not be surprised if I'm doing it right now. But I always do this thing where on streams I will like, um, I, uh, I'll like, I'll start talking about something and then something in the middle of that, uh, ex oh my god, this section. What am I, am I missing something? I, hold on, I need to take a second. Uh, oh no, I'm not missing it. It's just, it's just getting hurt knocks, um, knocks the time allotted down quite a bit. Oh, I'm killing these guys I can use to survive, by the way. I just noticed that. So that's why I get for talking about something serious over the final level. Um, <laughs> there we go. Yeah. All right. That's how you do it. Uh, okay. So I was saying before, I was like, I was like, I do this thing a lot where I'll start talking about something on like a stream or really just with anybody, but especially on stream when I have to like keep a, keep a, some kind of dialogue going. Um, I'll start talking, I'll start talking about something. I just killed another fucking guy! And, <laughs> and then, and then partway through, the thing that I'm talking about will, like, kind of trigger another thought, and I'll do, like, a, like, a tunneling into the conversation type deal, where I will just have, like, subject upon subject stacked on top of each other. And when I, when I start a new subject, I can't just, like, I have to like finish what I'm saying in order of when I started saying it, like backwards, right? Um, what am I, did I, did I get it? I don't know if I got it. Oh, I got it. But yeah, I was like, I'll do like a, I'll do like a tunnel in kind of, kind of thing where like, I like, yeah, I'll just like start talking and then like I'll 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 have another thought and so I'll follow that thought and then I'll have another thought inside of that thought and so I'll follow that through <laughs> and then when I'm done with like the third one I have to go back to the second one and then when I'm done with the second one I have to at that point it becomes so hard to remember what I even started with and I'll I'll say this a lot some of y'all may recognize I do this a lot where I, I I literally vocally express I say what what was I even talking about <laughs> it's like what got me here. Um, I've noticed, I, and I, I say that a lot, especially on streams, so, yeah, that's a thing where, like, that feels like a kind of, that feels like a kind of ADHD thing to do. Um, so yeah, it's just, I, I just, all this, all this just, and all this came from, um, all this came from someone asking me if, if, if if it was confirmed by Eddie Ishii, or saying that they thought it was confirmed. I got all this out of that. Which, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, ADHD is not an inherent negative, it's just something you gotta work with. So if I have it, I believe it is actually kinda good <laughs> for my commentary needs. Why am I just, <laughs> just, just flipping back and forth? It's kinda good for my commentary needs sometimes because it, it does help fill out the space like this, you know? And yeah, it allows me to do a talk. And as we joked about earlier, talking is literally, my job is to keep talking. <laughs> so like, it helps that I can, I, it helps that I can tunnel in so much, even if it gets a little messy and, and I, I sometimes have a laugh over just how fucking off the rails a conversation has gotten. Um, yeah, it's just, it, it, it's, it's nice. So you know, it's like there's pros and cons all over the place. But in terms of like keeping my apartment clean, very big negative. I that that alone, like, 
because that that shit kind of feeds into a lot of other things I deal with. Like I like I I talked about this before. I've developed like a genuine like kind of fear of cooking that I really need to get over. What the hell? Walking on the side. Um, I, yeah, developed like a genuine kind of like anxiety towards cooking that I really need to get over because I need to stop spending money on delivery and I need to uh, eat healthier. Uh, and I would like to be able to make things that are better for me, right? So like, anyway, so like all the, all the, all the things on delivery are not only, it's not only expensive to get delivery all the time, but also like delivery options are like, they're not, they're not good for me. <laughs> there's like, there's not a lot of restaurants around here that are like, like healthy options. Everything is like either fast food or like some sort of like, some sort of place that's like, oh yeah, eating this is like, 1500 calories for a single meal. Um, but, uh, it's not like you know there, but, uh, yeah, I mean, like, and, and I feel like my potential ADHD and, and lack of ability to, like, keep my fucking space organized all the time has contributed to that cooking anxiety because a big part of it clearly don't own an air fryer. I actually really want an air fryer. I keep forgetting to look into getting one of those. I really want to try that. Um, but, uh, the, the, the space, uh, the, the, the have, not having a super clean or organized space issue has really contributed to my cooking anxiety, um, because a big part of it is knowing that if I start to cook something, like, if I, if I set up to cook something, I, you know, take out the cutting board, I have to unpackage a lot of shit, like, I just have ingredients all over the place, you know, like, 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 like fucking pepper stems and everything like that. Like, I know I'm gonna come out of the other side with like a messy kitchen that I will need to clean up and I don't, I, I am not fully guaranteed to be able to clean it up, right? Because like, because of executive function issues. Um, which is a real issue for me. It literally, it, I will have like, I, within the past month, I have pulled out a recipe pulled out a couple ingredients and started working towards cooking something. And then I think, oh God, this is just gonna, this is gonna be everywhere. I will have to pick this up. And it's not that I don't want to pick it up. Like, it's just that I don't believe that I will. You know, it's like, it's, it's not a thing where it's like, oh, I don't want to clean up. It's like, no, I want to clean up, but I don't believe that I will. So I just don't do it. You know, like, like I, like I don't, I don't trust myself always to clean. I don't, I don't trust myself to clean up after I cook, so I just don't. It's a fucking problem. It's a problem because it's like, it's, 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 it's just like a, it's just a fucking, like, it's a chemical thing, yeah? Cause it's like, like a brain chemical thing where, like, like, I, I don't, I don't believe I am an undisciplined person. Like, I, I, I know, I know what needs to get done. I have no qualms with getting things done in theory. It is just something about the process of actually, like, connecting the desire to the action is just, like, fundamentally out of whack. Which I, I already kind of said, but just put a, put a cap around that little, little sidebar. You're literally describing shiz I go through. Well, I mean, hey, yeah, like, if, if you have the resources to, like, talk to somebody ab about this kind of thing, like, if you can, like, talk to your doctor or anything like that, like, I highly encourage it. If you have concerns, because, you know, you either could or you couldn't. But, like, talking to somebody who knows what they're doing and, and knows about it, or at least can help direct you to somebody who knows about Why the fuck did that not work? Who can help direct you to somebody who knows about it is really going to be a big help, because it just... If anything, it just helps with clarity and it helps with momentum. You know, I really, I started getting a lot of shit done recently that I've been putting off for months, if not years, just, just by taking the admittedly super hard, it is a super hard leap, but taking the leap to talk to somebody who, who can help you do that, who, who, who in my case, could help me do that. Um... So this this is one of them. I I'm still working towards this one. Like I said, I'm not currently medicated or anything. I don't. I I have never I have never yet talked to a professional about it. But I am working towards that. And um, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and call somebody tomorrow if my email is not responded to because it is it's something that 
as the years go on, and especially now, the longer I am in my own space and having to support myself in these ways, like, it is, it is genuinely affecting my quality of life, and in turn, because my quality of life becomes worse, it kind of feeds into the demotivation, and so it's harder for me to work, so it's harder for me to, like, make money, <laughs> which means it is much harder to feel confident about, you know, just, like, being able to stay where I live, you know? Like, it's a, it's a really shitty kind of cycle, so the sooner I can get help with it, the better. And if, if that's something you worry about, like, like, yeah, if, if, if you are able, talk to somebody. I highly, highly encourage it. I'm, I'm doing my best to, so work on that together. If you worry about not using ingredients, alternatives can help. I don't use eggs fast enough, so I use applesauce instead in baking. That's, that's really smart. Yeah, I, 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 I buy ingredients all the time intending to cook something and I and it just it goes bad and I have to throw it away and I it it yeah that 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 in particular feels like shit because I'm like I I paid for this I ha I had a, I had a delivery driver go out and get this for me and I'm not even gonna fucking use it like that that feels that feels awful um I was gonna say on that yeah so like uh, but also like there are even if you're not, like, talking to somebody in terms of, like, a doctor or, like, somebody who can maybe help look into, like, medication for that kind of thing, which is something I want to look into, but in the meantime, I'm trying to just, like, do what I can. Like I said, I want to get, like, I want to get, like, an air fryer, and also, I recently, I actually got a rice cooker recently. I think I talked about this on a stream, but I, I kept intending to look into getting a rice cooker, um, but hadn't yet, and I, I did. I have one now. I have a rice cooker, and it also came with, uh, came with a, with an egg, uh, like an egg cooker, of some kind. Either way, either way, I, tr I try it out, and it fucking rules. I was like, oh my god, yes. Yes. Any if when you remember to get an air fryer, they make a spare, I guess is really good, so if you like a spare of geese, then yeah. I, I love asparagus. I am, a, I am a relatively recent asparagus fan. I I grew up being a, a relatively picky eater. Um, and, you know, I'm trying to do my best to uh, expand my palate a lot. Uh, so I, I didn't, I literally, I didn't even try asparagus until like a couple of years ago. Uh, but it's fucking good. Especially if it's like, oh my god, please no, I'm <laughs> fucking fall down this and have to do all that again. My brain is, oh, okay, all right. We're getting to the point where I I'm, I need to wrap up this little conversation we're having so that I can maybe focus a little bit more on, on beating the game because I'm pretty sure I, I saw multiple people say this is the final level. I'm so close and it seems final level-esque. It's real, real tough. Yahoo! I non donated five dollars. The worst thing with ADHD and or autism is that I have new to typical relatives who also give suggestions that I know do not work. And it's really hard to explain why it will not work. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that's that's totally bad. Yeah, that that's that's a real thing. I um Well and it's funny because like I've never because like I feel like being able to get like officially diagnosed for me is gonna be a really big help with that kind of thing. At least, maybe not with some of my relatives. Some of my relatives are very, like, kind of conservative and probably won't hear it if I say, like, no, oh, my brain just doesn't work properly sometimes. Um, but, like, I know, like, with my mom, like, and, and it's not even, like, a like a bad intentions kind of thing. I, I mean, I love my mom. I don't, don't, don't get me twisted. Uh, <laughs> don't get me twisted. Ouch, I'm twisted. Um, <laughs> but I, I love my mom, but like sometimes whenever, you know, I try to talk to her about like difficulties in an executive function um, And granted again, th like I was saying, this is kind of Before having the exact vocabulary to talk about it, but you know, she would suggest things and I'd be like Yeah, I, I, I've tried that, you know, to kind of help with not being able to do this kind of thing and it's a situation where it's like I know 
it's it's a it's especially a little bit even more frustrating i'd say when when they mean well not not because it's their fault for meaning well it's just it's a little bit rough when you're like like i know this either works for you or like it's worked for somebody else and and, and that's great like that's fucking that's fantastic i just like it's a it's like it sometimes feels like i you know it's it's like they're not fully able to really get where you're coming from when you say like I don't know why I'm not doing this. It's not because I don't want to. <laughs> like, it's just not happening. And I've tried, but it's just not happening. And it's like, that's a really, that's a tough concept to communicate to somebody, especially, you know, like, especially maybe like older people or older relatives or something who like grew up without that kind of language and grew up without that kind of concept of like, no, actually there's more about ourselves than I think we think there is to understand all the time. And sometimes it is not our fault. Like in terms of like our spirit, sometimes it is not laziness. Like I, you know, I, I, I've, I've spent a very long portion of my life believing that I have a tendency to be a lazy person because I thought I was maybe just like not raised super well. Like, uh, like I don't know, but like, I'm like, no, but like, I've, I've heard certain things about like, sorry, mom, I'm just built different. Yeah. Uh, no, but like I've heard, I, I have had like values of like responsibility and, um, like, uh, you know, staying relatively active and productive about shit, like, like burned into me. Like I've heard it time and time again. I, I'm, I'm dead. I died. Cool. And now we're back here again. Oh my God. Is there a, is there a, oh, oh, thank you. This, this will help. I, I, I've had that kind of stuff like burned into my mind ever since I was a kid. Um, and you know, there, there are occasions where like, yeah, I, did, I didn't grow up with the best like examples around me and I'm a very lead by example kind of person. I, I learn visually the best, I think. I, I, I have a lot of, um, I'm a very, I'm, I grew up very much like a, I, 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 I mimicked a lot of shit, I think. Um, so like, uh, you know, it's just like, a, but, but even still, like I, I've been told time and time again, nah, you should, you should be responsible. You should do this kind of stuff when you need to do this kind of stuff. It's, it's like, so it's not, it's not for a lack of knowledge. It's not for a lack of, again, not for a lack of wanting or trying or believing that it's right to do better than I have been doing, but like, Again, it's like there's there's just something there that isn't it, the, those gears aren't aren't turning. Is something something needs to to grease up the old gears. I mean, is that hard to get that some people work differently in their mind? I well, for some people, yeah. I, I mean, at least in that kind of way. I mean, for some, you know, they 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 grew up in an environment where like. They were expected to perform, you know, specific tasks at a very specific level of competence. And like, you know, stakes were maybe high in terms of like reputation or, or like relationship or anything like that. And so it's like, you know, it's just like, like it's, it's a situation where like, well, if I didn't do such and such when I was growing up, like it was, it was, it must have been because I was lazy because people like got mad at me for it, right? <laughs> and like, you know, you don't you don't get mad at somebody for not doing something unless it's just because they're choosing not to. So like for some people, yeah, it's like it's shitty, but for for some, yeah, it is it is it is legitimately a hard concept to grasp that somebody not doing something does not automatically have to mean that it's because they don't want to do it or because they just are not disciplined enough or um you know just yeah it's 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 something that you know like we're like we, we still like as a as a culture as as a as a larger humanity are still learning a lot about how the mind works you know still learning a lot about even specific things like ADHD, like there's still so much to learn. And so, you know, when you grow up with a certain 
set of knowledge and you grow up with a certain um, level of like overall societal understanding of a topic that it tends to be hard to break out of that if you are someone who values what you already know rather than the the allure of the new because for some you know all their life they've just worked off of what they know and what they know has done pretty well for them so why would there have to be anything else <laughs> This is, a, this is an interesting conversation <laughs> on the last level of Ratchet and Clank. But also, again, it's it's pretty nice because uh, this is where we're repeating this section a lot. I, I got four fucking robots of my own, motherfuckers. Get them. Get them. Nice. Oh, I love my little guys. My mom donated five dollars. Oh, my dad was really bad, and still is with certain things, with not understanding how bad it was. Like I used to get nausea with my antidepressants, and it was when he learned that yes, it was still worth it. Made him learn how bad it was. Damn. Well, I, I mean, I'm glad. I'm glad that that he gained that perspective. I'm sorry that it, it took something like that to, you know, for him to connect with you on that level but like you know it, it i'm i'm glad that story has a happy ending at least but yeah no that that's a very real issue uh for for those struggling with like uh with um issues with with like neurodivergent patterns or or like uh you know just like just medical stuff you know like it's 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 tough when when you're trying to relate to somebody who like literally just cannot relate because they haven't experienced it themselves and like are not fully because like truthfully i think that empathy not well i don't know if it's, it's empathy or sympathy which, whichever one is the one where it's like more intellectual than like like a feeling like like the act of like actively kind of like thinking about the experience of others and applying that um i think that one is empathy i think that i think that i think i got that right um but like I, I consider it like kind of a I mean it, it's a skill you have to like train and work on and continuously work on. Um and and like I said, it's a situation where for some people they just and this is not like a like a damning sort of like you are a shitty person if you haven't done this necessarily, but like it it is a thing where like a lot of people have not had enough life experience that like that like necessitated them to learn more of that than they already knew because again it was just what they had already or what they had already picked up by a certain point was all they have needed and so you know it's like a lot of people don't really fully know how to take somebody's words and kind of like like almost like like it's it's kind of like like a language. You have to translate what someone is saying about their experience into a belief that that experience is real, which is really fucking hard, because you're just hearing it as words. Like you you can never if you don't experience what somebody else is going through, you can never fully understand what it feels like to feel that. But there is a skill you can develop and 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 sort of nurture to like language translate their words into at least like a an external understanding that helps you be helpful to that person and that applies to a lot of shit um but again it like again like the fifth time i said this it is a skill you have to work on that in order to get better at that they just keep spawning in back at, yeah no they really they are not letting up and i again have so little hits left. Shit. Oh my god. I was I was fucking it was like the last guy probably. Ah! 
Okay, all right. I think it's kind of case by case. For some, empathy isn't an inherent skill, but some people have big empathy without, without even trying. I th we, we start at different points, for sure. There's like a natural sense of like understanding that I think one can have. Um, but I, I, I think, I, personally, I would say you might be more conflating that with the experience of sympathy, which is the more emotional kind of like, kind of like, like emotional sponge kind of deal where it's like you literally like feel when you see other people feeling certain things. Um, the, the thing that I'm talking about, like, again, like, the, the translation kind of thing, um, understanding through listening, I feel like, I, 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 of course, you know, everybody's different, I, I feel like the brains are incredibly fucking cool and complex, so yeah, I, I would, I would believe that people start with, like, at different starting, starting points, um, with that kind of, <laughs> might as well just fucking, that one didn't count! I feel like other people can start at different starting points of that kind of thing, for sure. I, I wouldn't say they can't. I don't know everybody on Earth and where they started and where they are, so it'd be a ridiculous thing for me to say that that can't happen, but I think more often than not, it is it is something you really have to nurture before it is, like, even useful, per se. That's maybe a more cynical way to word it than I actually intend it to sound, or, or that I, like, intend, like, that I believe it, you know? Little guys. Oh shit! I just knocked him off. Where's your jetpacks now, motherfucker? I wish the vendors had like health or something that seems rough. Well, I mean, I, I like I do too. Don't get me wrong. I in this case, uh, the vendor is only at the beginning of this checkpointed section. There are no vendors throughout, so it, that wouldn't even be useful to me. And in this section specifically, it would just be a case where like, when when I got back to that vendor that I just went to, it would just be like, I, I would have had to have died to get back there, so I'd be at full health again anyway. Although it would help for when I'm trying to exit that hallway and I maybe get hit a couple times, I can just go back and grab a, grab a full health again, just top me off a little bit. But at that point, really, yeah. Oh shit, he's behind me. Um. What other weapons do we have that we haven't been using? I haven't been using the, I'm gonna go to the quick save. I haven't used the blitz cannon in a while. Should use the plasma coil more. Um. Meteor gun. I might give the meteor gun one more chance. <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna regret that probably. Vaporizer, no thanks. Blitz cannon. Um, I'm gonna take out the tractor beam. No, not tractor beam, the fucking dynamo here. So that'll be useful to just have on quick select so I don't have to keep going to the Um and the... I'm gonna replace the. Are you, I might I might replace the lava lava whatever the fuck with the blitz cannon actually maybe ah who's to say or media gun say media gun this just in CNN <laughs> this just in CNN. Fuck you! Hey, yeah, it's actually not not so bad. It takes a lot of hits, though. It takes a lot of hits. Nah, it's not. Yeah. This gun shoots videos. It's just the infamous weapon. <laughs> Bitch. Bitch. <laughs> Bitch. Sit your ass down. Bitch.
His head's gone. The bitch gun? The bitch gun. Um, come back to the. I'm bringing out the killinoids again and saving the bouncer for later. I'm gonna mini rocket. Here we go. <laughs> they got him! They fucking got him. That was great. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it. I knew I made the right choice. Right choice? Right choice for what? My best friend. My best dynamo. <laughs> My best friend. <laughs> How many times have I referenced that on stream? Probably like five at this point. Okay. Bouncer time. Brempathy, I can tell when bread's been sliced nearby. Does it does it yell at you? Oh shit, okay. Alright, alright. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. <laughs> So mad! The, is, the way they just this, the way this room just drains my health is so infuriating. No, it just hurts a little bit. Damn, that sucks. If, if you if you physically felt like a little like tinge of some tinge of pain whenever bread was cut, oh my god. Well, you know what? I guess... Uh, yeah, it wouldn't be too bad. Most people buy pre-sliced bread anyway. And, you know, that, that bread is made sliced. It's never sliced in the factory or anything. That's how that works. Okay. We good? You're not gonna spawn any more ground guys? Okay. It's time to take care of the sky guys. Yeah. The sky guys try dying. Alright, um... Infiltrator time, fuck you. Started at the wrong one, fuck you again. Just for extra. Okay, cool, all right. We're really just, yeah, okay, all right, yeah, sure. Okay, all that, all that progress completely, completely, ch Are you telling me I'm right fucking next to it and you're not gonna let me go? <laughs> oh my God. I know, I can't go up. <laughs> this shit. Oh my god. <sighs> what the hell? Okay, alright. Alright! Okay, all right, here we go. Infiltrator, fuck you. You fucking suck. Okay, cool, now I'm on the ice. Thank you, protopads. All right, yeah, sure, whatever. Oh, God, oh, please, please, no, shit. <laughs> Save me. Since <laughs> <laughs> this is what hamsters see inside their balls. Um. Alright. Um, do anything? No, it's just... What? I was just kind of there? Alright. No, it has to be puzzle important. Oh! There we go, okay. I guess not. When are you playing the G-Force game on stream, Penny? This is what the people want. Uh, I used to have the G-Force game on like the DS, I think. It wasn't good. I played it once and then never touched it again. Uh, right when I fucking switched out the swing shot, too. Apparently in game number three is, is, is finally when they uh, 
they they change up the mechanics so you don't have to manually switch to the hook shot every time, which is gonna be an absolute blessing. Can't wait to get to that one. Next stream, <laughs> right? Right, we're beating this. We're beating this tonight. Ooh, ah, ha, ha. I almost just launched myself directly into the abyss with my own fucking flip. All right, this is this isn't working. <laughs> that shit isn't working either. Fuck. Uh, please. Oh my god, these tanks are fucking ridiculous. These tanks are insane. These tanks are insane. Oh. Come on, come on, get it, get it, get it. Fuck. It's gotta be it. There we go. Oh my god. All right, 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 all right. Please, no more. Give me a checkpoint, please. Begging you. Okay, we have two health two health things in a vendor. That's not what I asked for, but I will take it. Uh okay. Woo! Oh my god, my neck was fucking stiff. I don't know if y'all heard that. Is there a way to skip these fights in this game? Nah, these fights... <laughs> these fights are the game. This is Ratchet and Clank. Oh, you mean like on a retry? I mean... I... I don't think it would... You don't... I, you don't technically have to kill every enemy um but it it's it's a lot harder to survive just trying to brute force your way past than it is to just like find a good way to kill them like you're, you're more likely to survive being on the offense unless you're just like really super unreasonably good at dodging so at, at this late in the game this game almost starts to feel like a bullet hell <laughs> With all the all the uh, projectiles coming your way. Woo! No, don't fucking multiply. You know that I hate math. Don't fucking multiply or I will blow up your path. If you shoot another guy outside of your mouth and he shoots another one, I'll get the fuck out. Yeah, oh my god, oh god! Ah. Hey, you off camera and they suddenly... Halt. We violated the law. Shit. Oh, I was just given a blessing of so much health. I really don't want to waste that. What are you doing? Answer. Lancer time, it's got range, baby. There we go. Alright. Another tank, cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's just do some HK 22s. There's just like three just three missiles every shot. It's awesome. Yeah, nice. Uh. 
Uh... Ch Chad is talking about math now. I have gotten... I have gone concerningly quiet, I just realized, because I'm, I'm just so... I uh, was overwhelmed in this yet even more. Yet even more. This is oh, it. The okay. Duplication room. <laughs> no, <laughs> Angela, look out! The it's the bouncer! No problem. You're just in time. Okay, let's see if this thing works. She is trying to tell us something. It's a bitch stop. Bye now. Enjoy the high Steve. <laughs> Remember, you bought it from Steve. <laughs> Some Markiplier. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh no. Now that I've sold my one millionth hygienator, I can finance the comeback of the greatest superhero who ever lived. Captain Quark. All I need now is a new galaxy with a new fan base so I can rescue them from a new disaster. <laughs> Are you behind the shit too? The fuck? <gasps> Sir, I do not understand. Mr. Fizz Widget. <laughs> oh my god, fuck you! <laughs> Me too. Oh my god. I'm about to save the galaxy from the protopets, and you are about to become public enemy number one. Holy and shit. Two, I three. did not know Four. that. Seize them. What Smile. the hell? It's showtime. <clears throat> Citizens of Bogon, I am Captain Quark. I come to you Mega Quark donated five dollars. You didn't see shit. Have a Quarktastic day. Oh, hold on. Also, I got on your galaxy. I'm sorry. I really. <laughs> I want to hear this custom. <laughs> Thank you. Though. As you know, a living menace called the Proto Pet has been set loose in your galaxy. But fear not, Boganites. I, Captain Quark, have caught the perpetrators. Yes, good citizens. These are the masterminds behind <laughs> Megacorp's experiment with death. And now, with this, uh, super electro gadget I invented, oh my I God. will end the protopet threat once and for all. What a bastard. That's my elixamorph. I invented... <sighs> Ahem. Stay tuned, dear viewers, as I amplify the signal from this helix so thingy and render every protopet in the galaxy completely harmless. Allow me to demonstrate. God, now it makes... That makes a lot of sense as to why Fizz Widget was just so ridiculously antagonistic from the get-go. Um, this thing... Oh my god, hey, this thing... Hey, what the that fuck? Does that actually work? It used to. I could probably fix it. Come on, Clank. Let's get it back. Oh my god, what a... What what an incredible twist. That's so fun. Yeah, and then I didn't... I have never once gotten that even remotely spoiled. I mean, there's a lot about this game that I, I just... I have never heard, like, anything about. So, like... That's... That's crazy. People don't talk about, like... I mean, I don't, uh, I guess, I guess I don't really, I don't hang out in too many Ratchet and Clank circles until recently, so I wouldn't have heard much about any of the games. Oh, shit. All right, here we go. Um, all right, these guys for sure. You know what? It's time to bring back an old friend. <laughs> oh, they're not even, oh, they're not even doing anything right now. He's rolling. He's rolling too much. He's rolling. What is, uh, what's this all about? Oh, it's ammo. That makes sense. Hello? Oh, you just... Oh. You eat the ammo? <laughs> to shoot it at me? Do I have to break the boxes before you can get it? That's fun. 
Just get a bunch of these guys over here. Yeah, all right. Let's just uh, let's just go this way and get rid of that one. Thank you very much. Come on, stop, stop, stop it, stop rolling, stop rolling. Oh shit! No, fuck these guys. Truly and entirely fuck the proto pets. <laughs> they are garbage. Oh! Over here! Oh, nice. Alright. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you for giving me more turrets. I have been flattened into some kind of pancake. No, they're uh, they're focusing too much on the proto pets. They're not getting this guy. All right, bouncer time. Yahoo! I'm on donated five dollars. <laughs> oh, tears through. I'm genuinely surprised you did not know when you mentioned how you were wondering if Captain Cork would show up. Then said he would not. I really thought you were being coy. Guess not. No, I I really didn't know. I was like genuinely wondering. I was like, is he gonna show up in this game? But, like, it makes so much sense, though. Ha! Ah, ah, ha! Hello! Hi! Oh, wait, does, does it still get hurt even with the shield on? Oh, I think- I guess it does! I didn't even realize- I- I thought- I thought that was just, like, a straight-up shield. Monster time! Oh, no, I- I didn't get the ammo. That's fine. The last one was- oh, I was gonna say the last one was pretty easy to dodge. I didn't realize he was gonna change it up, though. Those are bombs! Oh, the frame rate. <laughs> oh, mine. Thank you! Oh no! Oh shit! Okay. Alright. We had a good run. We had a good run. This, this is a pretty fun fight. I like this. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, this feels like... <sighs> no, you know what? I have a feeling this isn't the final boss. I feel like we gotta fight Quark. But I don't feel like... There's not gonna be like a whole level after this, so... We might as well... Can we get anything? Shield Charger? Shield Charger would maybe help quite a bit. Yeah, yeah, we'll get the shield charger. Thank you! <laughs> oh, nice. Alright. Um... Stock up on my... I'm, I'm, I can't see myself using the... The blitz cannon a lot, so I'm replacing that... With the shield charger. Um, and then... Mini nuke might actually... Be a pretty safe bet... Uh, okay, I'm not using the stars a lot, so I'll replace the stars with the mini nuke. Yeah, and the bouncer, uh, mini turret gloves, HK22, I will, s I'll let stick around. Okay, all right, cool. Oh, and then, um, swing shot, we only use this one, so I'll just put it in the menu again. Okay, all right. Let's get this shit down. Okay, just want to tear through him with the bouncer real quick. It seems like it does less damage when he has this rolling thing on, though. Ooh, mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. He's doing well. Mine. That's for me. Oh, yes. Just tear through his skin like a beep jerky. Oh. Worth it. Worth it. <laughs> 
Jesus. Oh, I didn't even realize there's multiple enemies here. I didn't I didn't see these guys. I was just too busy focusing on the on the dude. Oh shit. Huh. huh. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Uh shield charge, please. Huh. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Illinois. Yeah, I didn't have a chance to break that. Oh shit! Fuck you! It's insult to injury, <laughs> bitch. You do stay still for a very long time while you're doing that, though. I actually don't mind. I, you know what? I should. I kind of feel like I should let him pick those up more. No, you know what? They're. Oh well, I can't. Can't help that one. He essentially already has it. <laughs> Oh. Oh. oh, I don't have the shield charge anymore. Uh, grab that. Oh, the tanks. Are you serious? Oh, the tanks are not welcome here. The tanks are not welcome here. How do I have so many bouncer shots left? The bouncer feels like it should have, like, five shots. <laughs> oh, we're so close, so close. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, there we go. You did it. We did. It's okay. This is the real Mr. Fizzwidget. Quark had him tied up in a supply closet. Still a all this CEO time. though. <laughs> Fuck him. You have my most profound gratitude. It was nothing, sir. I'm just sorry we couldn't get the helixo morph back. Oh, was it the final boss? Oh shit. What do you suppose is wrong with it? Uh, I don't know. It could take months of research and the battery is in backwards. Oops. Imbecilic to the very last. Damn, I thought it was gonna be like a like a like a <laughs> kind of fake out final point. boss where Quark comes Just in. Just to amplify the device with Megacorp's TV transponders, and that should cure the other proto pets. Clank? Uh oh. <gasps> oh no! It's okay. I can fix her. I promise. Why are you saying I promise like that? Whoa! Oh shit! Okay! Wow! Oh my god, that that ended that ended quicker than I thought it would. <laughs> Damn! Hell yeah! Oh that's that was that was fun. That we did it. We fucking did it. We did it! We're on our way! We just beat the longest Ratchet and Clank game. Or at least the estimated to be the longest. What a what a good feeling. All right, so then uh, on Tuesday we'll be uh, we'll be starting the final game in the original trilogy, Ratchet and Clank: Up Your Arsenal, is, is the actual name of the game. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm gonna stay through the credits. I'm not ending right away, but uh, yeah, let's just talk. Let's just talk a bit. Um, yeah, so Tuesday I'm starting uh, number three. Which will be the last game before we reach the uh, future series. Um, uh, it is the shortest of the original so trilogy, so that's fun. Do like do for fun. Don't forget the hyphen between. Oh, sorry, oh. sorry, <laughs> sorry. <Goodness. laughs> so, whatever happened to Quark? I heard he was working at Megacorp. So, you fell No, we're not doing here. dead locked. <laughs> You boys should sign up for the new Probomatic. That little baby cleans just something fierce. I just got done testing the full body vaccinator. I am personally sporting a smooth chassis, and there are no tags on my luggage. All right then. Catch you later. Subject 23A. Please report immediately for a crystalizer <laughs> testing. Well, 
Duty calls. What a gross guy. Um, I'll replay that last donation. Sorry, sorry, sorry for the mute. Uh, just mid cutscene. Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Daniel Shadal donated five dollars. Oh wow, I actually caught a stream a little. Ooh, did I actually come at the end of the game? Damn. Yes, unfortunately, it seems you did. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the vod though. If you like to watch it, um, yeah, I I, I really appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, I, and this is like this is a main story primarily playthrough. So we we just we we did dodge a lot of shit, and also I did a lot of stuff off screen. So there, this game could have been so much longer. Um, yeah, that's kind of the case with all of them. Um, man, this was fun. This is really fun. I so now that it's done, I still think I I I think I had. I still think I overall had a better experience with the first game. I truly, I truly think that the first game is such. It's it's a little bit more cohesive. This game does so much more, and it's it's not all the best, but most of it is like really good and really cool. But also, it it can feel a little bit uh, scattershot. It 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 takes a really long time. To, uh, to to find its focus story wise and and I I that ending is you know it's fun it's all fun it's all charming I was not expecting that ending to be so quick like that was that was that, that wrapped up soon <laughs> like that was that was like nothing at all um you know the first game you have that really really nice little moment with uh with Clank and Ratchet at the end or right, you know he's like hey Tin Can Maybe we still need to fix that arm. There's like, there's like no sort of like, I just not really any character development in this game. Really, like, All right, fellas. oh, well, more scenes. So you tested this, right? Oh, wait, that's why I'm here. <laughs> oh, one more thing. <laughs> oh shit, oh God. His dick. Oh god, his dick. Um, yeah, so from a gameplay perspective, this game rules. This game did so much right with the gameplay uh, expansions and, and changes and stuff. Story-wise, the first game is a lot better. I think this the story in this one does not even hold a candle to how, how good the first game was to go through and kind of like learn about the world and and get a sense of the character progression and stuff even if again i've said this before i will concede that ratchet is too mean in the first game um for too long um but i still appreciate seeing that growth even if it's a little bit too much of one extreme for most of it um it's uh yeah it's it's interesting it's interesting i uh yeah, i'm i'm i have i i i, I have conflicted feelings about the story direction of this game but that was still a blast to play this is not don't don't take this as me saying like uh you know i had a bad time or that i had a less good time in particular i just think i i really connected to that first game i i've said before but like within the first like four hours or so of playing ratchet and clank one i was like oh this is one of my favorite ps2 games already i was like this i i it like it grabbed me and then this game takes that um this game takes that really good gameplay that's like super addicting and 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 like fun fun to play through and, and mess around with and stuff and it it ups the ante in that sense but the thing that actually grabbed me which was like the tone and the environments and the and the st and and the context of those environments and like the the story of everything, even if it's not particularly complex, I feel like it was actually the straightforwardness, the way it's more straightforward than this game and more simple than this game actually made it easier to connect to. Because if you're going to do a story that's more complex, like this one tries to do, you really need to sell it with the depth that supports that complexity and the time that supports that complexity. And while this game is longer, it's not long enough to really fully support that or like truly 
give you a real sense of even like what the point of all this is or what's going on. I think, um, you know, like the, the proto pets are just kind of there. They're just kind of like a, like a MacGuffin kind of thing, which is fine. MacGuffins are fine. They're, they're, they're a, they're a storytelling device. Um, Quark, I, I, I liked seeing him come in with the twist. I think the twist is really cool, but like, it's the twist and then it's like five minutes of gameplay and the game's done <laughs> like that. That feels a little weird. That kind of stuff is where it makes a lot of sense that this game was made in like a year. That kind of shit is exactly where I'm like, oh, yeah, I see why <laughs> I like I I can see where they compromise to get this game done in such a short turnaround. Um, and it's, it's, it's just unfortunate that the compromises, you know, had to be there. Um, not, not, not that they had to be there. I just mean like, um, I guess that they were pressured to be there in order to get the game done that quickly. I assume there was some publisher bullshit that, that made that quick of a turnaround time. I, I, I don't know. I wasn't there and I haven't, uh, I haven't researched a lot of the development ways of, of the series. So that reveal should have come in like two thirds of the way through at least. Yeah, that, that should have happened a lot. I feel like. I, you know what? It's like they, they spent way too much time having Ratchet kind of like apologize for Fizzwidget's behavior. If they had cut out like the back half of that weird continuing character trait and like pushed the rest of the story upwards and then did more of the end after the reveal, that would have, I feel like that would have made the story a lot smoother. Uh, because even like last stream, when, when they revealed the proto pet scheme and how they were kind of like going crazy and we had to like stop the production. I was like, Oh, this feels like when the story starts and we got like one and a half streams out of that. This game took five streams to play and only like one and a half of those streams. I actually felt like we were playing through a story and not just kind of like, uh, doing sightseeing, you know? But I feel like th th this is a case where, like, I'm saying more negative things right now. Not because I feel more negatively about the game, but just because the negative things are more interesting to talk about. Whereas the rest of it is, like, that was great. Like, that's really, like, what else can you say about the good stuff other than, wow, really fun, really good. <laughs> like, I thoroughly enjoyed that. Um, The game does have thugs for less. That is... Yeah, yeah, like, and and this is the I my issues with this game are, are purely from a tone and from a pacing standpoint. Um, uh, like the actual like individual characters and set pieces and and the humor and stuff is all just as charming as ever, if not more. Uh, so it's it's not an issue with with the characters or um even the concept of the story in and of itself. I just feel like the execution of the pacing and and the uh the the scope of everything could have been could have been done better but otherwise i had a fantastic time uh there's a, there's a challenge mode there's a time warp thing um i'm not gonna do either of those right the second i am gonna wrap up here because it is 12 in the morning it's 12 30 for me right now and i would like to chill out and uh then get some rest tonight so uh yeah yeah, yeah. uh w we did it we finished it that's awesome i was i was worried <laughs> Uh, but we got another uh, four out of stream out of, four hour stream out of this one. So that is super duper, super duper nice to see and to have done. Uh, yeah, Tuesday, we are gonna start uh, number three in the series. and then um, I feel like later this week, I'm uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do on Wednesday. Uh, I, I, I mean, it's either gonna be more it takes two with marble or it's gonna be um, I'm going to start a, uh, a randomized playthrough of Prey from 2017, which uh, the Discord, uh, the sub Discord server uh, voted on um, for my next uh, uh, like playthrough to, 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 to do after we recently finished Control. Um, but yeah, uh, for now, let's, uh, let's set up a raid. Let's set up a raid, everybody. Sounds like a good idea to me. Any any raid phrases that come to mind? Uh, how about? 
Uh, Chase is currently streaming the Binding of Isaac, so let's uh, let's raid. Remember the let's, let's raid Chase. Um. <laughs> Crotchetizer to meow. <laughs> meow. <laughs> yeah, the ch chat is mostly saying meow. Let's do meow. Okay, raid phrase meow. I'm not even going to paste it. It's just, just one word. Um, all right, I'm going to set this up. Oh, okay, I'm going to get going. Hey, uh, again, thanks so much for coming, everybody. If this is your first stream, I hope you had a great time. I hope you'll consider coming back in the future for more fun times uh if you have not followed the channel and turned on notifications yet that is one of the best ways to know about when these things are happening if you are subscribed and you have not joined the sub exclusive discord server yet exclamation point discord for more info on how on how to do that that is also a really good way to know that when these things are happening because i ping the discord server every time i start a stream so if you have notifications turned on for that server uh you will get those notifications as i begin so that is a great way if you are subbed you like to have a place to hang out and talk about streams uh, or uh, other stuff. Um, otherwise, uh, as always, please be good to yourselves. Please be good to others as well. Uh, do something nice for yourself if you haven't in a while. Have a wonderful day or night, whatever it is where you are. Um, I'm going to be back, like I said, on Tuesday with Ratchet & Clank 3, Up Your Arsenal. Uh, uh, and, and just to further our fun little... Uh, Ratchet and Clank playthrough. I'm so excited. I'm excited. Um, yeah, uh, thanks for coming, everybody. Let's go say hi to Chase. My good, good, very good friend, Chase. Uh, all right. Good night. Bye.